scabs all over it. <laughs> just do it. Just fucking do it. Yeah, just get it done. In the famous words of Nike, the sports god, just fucking get it over with already. Nike, the god of sport. High on Mount Olympus. Doping like a Russian fucking Olympian. Oh my god. Yeah. Looks like people are coming in. Hello, people. How are you all doing tonight? Welcome. Uh, Vindogi, Katon, Anagelical, Meridian 5, Christian, live, purely. What's up? Thanks for coming to check it out. Peen Crows. Yes, quid. Dank ass cookies. Bun time, Joey, Cream Hearts. The whole gang is here, Wolf. Check it out. Oh, man. So. Look at all this. We owe an explanation uh, of what the fuck uh, we're doing. Here's my quest. My quest is to go where no man has gone before. To bring you guys, my cherished audience, new and exciting kinds of content. All right? That, you know, you can't find anywhere else in the, in the galaxy. This is going to be the bootleg show, or what I'm calling that bootleg show. And I thought that that was a clever title because it's, it's, um... It's like, oh, yeah, that bootleg show, that bootleg show. As in, like, this is a this is a bootleg of something that's been done before. I think I mean, if it's happened on on Twitch, I, I don't I don't know. But I feel like this is listen, I'm not the first person to want to, to wanna just look at bootlegs for content. But uh, so it's a it's a thing about bootlegs that happens to, to be bootleg. So I just. I fucking went for it. Um, Wolf, who you may know from the stream, is my uh, my, my co-host. If you want to introduce yourself, uh, Wolf, to the to the stream. Hey, everybody. I'm here to show wonderful bootlegs to Mike. Here's the idea. Wolf found a bunch of bootlegs for me. I haven't seen them before. We're going to look at them. We're going to analyze them. We're going we're gonna to pick them apart. We're going to dissect them. We're going to put them on a table and we're, we're going to operate piece by piece down to the molecular level. The thing that I love to do when I'm live, but it pisses everybody off because I'm actually playing a video game and they came there to see the fucking video game, not, not some asshole looking at a bootleg. That, right? You know how that happens? This is just... I have, however long we go, I figure we'll go like an hour or, or whatever, however long... Uh, However long it takes, whenever we feel like we're running out of uh, fucking steam here, just see what we got. Just, just hit me with them. I've been, oh, man. been talking about this for a while. We'll see how it goes. If it's cool and you guys like it, whatever, I'll keep fucking doing it. If you don't like it, go fuck yourself. I'll keep doing it anyway. Just kidding. Um, but yeah, I mean, I'm always trying to come up with ideas for things that aren't just me going live and and, and fucking playing a video game. So you'll see, it's IRL. Uh, IRL category, I mean, even though some of these bootlegs, I, I think, are going to feel like th th we're not in real life anymore. Um, where's the thing that you linked me before we started? Uh, let me see, where did that go? Oh, there it is. Uh, hold on a minute. Blah, 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 blah. Where's my word file that I had? I had a word file with shit in it. I had a word <laughs> file loaded with shit that I wanted to get into, and now I can't find it. Oh, well, fuck that. Um, Here's our, our first thing here. And I was I actually had intended to just open with this, but it looks like um I forgot. Oops. Uh... And I'm just gonna pop this in here. I'm 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 gonna just uh, first of all I I want to say that I I think it's fake. Uh, I'm actually like ninety nine point nine point nine percent uh positive that this is about somebody having a laugh. But uh, Wolf showed it to me and it just cracked me the fuck up. I like the amount of love that went into this here. Have you have you really tried to pick this apart yet? Have you tried to dig into this? 
I went looking around. I can't find who made it. There are some people talking about it, but no matter what, they put in a lot of effort into they it. They did! Even, even for a bootleg. If it was a real bootleg, that's still way more effort than a bootlegger would put in. Why would you not want to do everything you can to take credit for this masterpiece? This is again, you know, I have an issue with people not signing their shit, like when they do art, when they submit art to the stream. Because I want you to sign it, because I want people to know, you know, who did it. I want people to get credit for it, you know. Like, this is beautiful. Um, I mean, you got the, 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 this was the giveaway. This was the thing that made me say, like, all right, this is, this cannot be genuine. Is you got the dude from Firefly standing there. Whose name I don't, I don't fucking know. But he's, he's standing there, he's wearing the Star Trek outfit. It says Star Wars. This is like, you know, the grandpa mistake. You know, you got uh, somebody who I have no idea who that is. I think she might be from Firefly, too. You see you see the chick right next to the uh, right next to the TARDIS there? Floating <laughs> that's around, the floating entire around cast in the back. Of... Yeah, it... That's the whole Firefly cast. It, right is, it is the whole Firefly cast. I, I yeah. have it's been a while since I, I, I watched it. So I don't I don't you know, I don't fucking remember. I thought the guy all the way on the left was like Chris Pine. But I definitely remember, yeah, I definitely recognize the captain. But, I mean, I don't, maybe this is, like, fucked up, but I feel like that woman immediately to the left of uh, of the captain, he just, like, that's, like, she she just is, like, a bootleg uh, Marina Sirtis. Like, just, somebody tried to, like, clone her, and, like, they, they fucked up a little bit. And this Maybe that's, like, a, a fucked up thing to say. I'm sure she's a unique, wonderful human being, but she, yeah, she looks like a failed Marina Sirtis clone. Maybe it's the, it's probably the uniform. I think it's just the uniform. Um, yeah, I did the the dude, right? Because that was um not Scotty, the Irish dude, uh, Sonny, right? Bean me up, Sonny, right? That was his catchphrase in Firefly. Bean me up, Sonny. Yeah, remember yeah, that? So. Bean me up, Sonny. Uh, you also, yeah, you do have the TARDIS in, in the back there, chilling. The Starship, the Starship Enter Falcon is bigger on the inside. It's also pretty big on the outside, too. I don't know if you noticed. But yeah, this is delightful. I like the, um, the fold lines and the aging that was, that was done, like, with such tender love and care. Are you seeing that? A lot of love went into this bootleg. Hello, Nimbo, uh, Nimbo Cadis. What's up? Thanks for coming tonight. She's a grown-up version of Veruca, Veruca Salt from Willy Wonka. <laughs> <laughs> the Millennium Tardis, Efric. There, yeah, there's, uh, there's a lot of ways that you, you could go with this. Um, but you also have some yeah, non-intentional bootlegs that you, you dug up, am I right? Oh, yeah. Oh, man. Hmm. So uh, we dig into those a little bit. We take it back down to Earth here. Yeah. Take now, it back I, I down don't know. To Earth. I, I don't know what kind of anime you might have watched, but did did you ever watch an anime called Shirley Moore? I never watched any anime because anime is garbage. So, you know, I don't know. I don't know what you're saying that to me for. You know, uh, Shirley Moore, very popular. Oh with, uh, my! Kent. Oh my goodness! Is that is that the Shirley Moore? Yeah, that's Shirley Moore. Oh, of course I remember this from my childhood. What? What? Of course I do. Now you guys are going to remember this. I mean, not you know, not not to be confused with you know Mary Tyler Moore or anything like that. Oh, by the way, I wanted to play music. I have some classical music. I forgot about that. Uh, just let me know if there's a volume issue. I, you know, I want you to be able to hear me. I want you to. I want you to hear Wolf. Uh, I want you to hear um, the music. But yeah, take a look at this. Uh, as every everybody remembers Shirley Moore, of of course. And uh, wow, look at that. Of course, you, you don't forget her sidekicks. Um, Venus Flytrap. Uh, Neptunia. Of course. Yep, yep. Uh, what's the one uh, second from the left there? Uh, I think that was Venus Flytrap. 
Uh, you know that that's that's surely less. You have surely more. You also have surely less. Surely less. Oof. Surely more bootlegs are the answer. And all the way on the right there, you got uh, you, you, you got fucking Uranus Moon. Uranus Moon. One of the what is that? Uranus has like seventy moons or some shit. Uranus Moon. Was there a Uranus Moon in Sailor Moon? Uh, yeah, there was a Sailor Uranus. Did they pronounce it Uranus? Yeah, they did. <laughs> That's very disappointing to me. You couldn't have lied to me. Uh, I I didn't want to make things too hopeful for you. Yeah, yeah. Don't you know? Just don't set me up and then knock me down like that. I appreciate that. I've had enough disappointment in my fucking life. Look at this. I love this. Can we take a look at the actual action figure too, and and how it looks? I, it, it, absolutely nothing like that image. At all. Why does he have cat ears? Why are there cat ears? Shirley meow Oh my god, who knew? And she's it's 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 like a, it's like a kid. It was is that a is that a, a character a Sailor Moon character at, at all? Yeah, that's that's the uh mini moon. The mini moon. Oh wow, I, I, I hate this a lot. I want you to know how I want you to know how much I hate this. I'm very happy. And by hate this I mean love this. It's not even the worst one I've found. Magical girls. Shirley Moore definitely brought a. Uh, they, they they say it laid the foundation for the entire magical girls genre in, in anime. Uh, yeah, I, I think I think modern anime actually owes, owes a lot to Shirley Moore. Doesn't it? This this was the starting point, you know. Shirley Moore, she. She really opened some doors for people. The anime Lord. that started it all. We shouldn't actually be sitting here laughing at it. You know, I think we're assholes for that. The company is Pop Rewind. Oh, no, 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 sorry. That looks like that's, I, I don't know, the people who took the picture. And uh, it's made in China, it says back there. Everybody knows that the best anime actually comes from China, not Japan. This is a well-known fact. Oh, this these this fucking classical music is gonna have advertisements. All right, hold on, I got a solution for that. Surely, fucking more. Hold on, I'm gonna get that music back. One second. There we go. Thank you. Shirley Moore needs a uh, a love interest, by the way. What could we do for Shirley Moore's love interest? Business casual mark. Cause I, me I I feel like a tuxedo would be would be too formal for uh you know for somebody who's interested in, in, in dating Shirley Moore. Business casual mark, that's his name. Yeah, could go with that. Any mark like like mask. Yeah, it's just they yeah, they misspelled mask. So it <laughs> isn't business casual mark. Coxedo mask, Peen Crows. I like the way you think. Leisure suit mark, Black Bear, nice. <laughs> the music is barely audible. Thank you. Uh, um Thank you for that. This is a classy stream, so I, I figured we'd have some uh, classical music to uh really get across the refined nature of what it is that we're doing here. Oh, I also forgot to um, use the background that I wanted to use. Let's get this. Let's 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 do something. Let's do something creative here. Let's get this up in the corner there. We'll catty corner that. Appropriate since it's uh, you know, Shirley Moore is a cat girl. And then we're gonna do. Uh, oh my. Oh, you got. Oh, you got more. Ma you got more magical girls for me. Oh yeah. Oh my goodness. So the magical the magical girl fun uh, does not end there. Here we got uh, beauty fighters, which was introduced as a concept to compete with the uh, the ugly fighters, 
which was a very popular anime anime in, in Japan in the uh, the late eighties. Am I am I right? The Ugly Fighters. Huge, huge. The the it was a huge anime. Yeah. So what they were doing here is they were trying to tap into that market, but they were trying to put their own spin on it. And the ironic thing about the beauty fighters here is if you really look at their faces, they're they're fucking hideous. Holy shit. <laughs> Somebody was hitting the bottle. Oh man. Oh, it's a <laughs> It's a shame that the image is so low res, but you can you can see the uh, the derpitude going on here. Oh my god, this one's head is totally spherical. Oof! But it's doing a fucking Nazi salute. Check that out. Is it also a cyclops, or am I uh, am I just seeing what I want to see here? Uh, looks like there might be a third eye there. The one all the way on the left. You you seeing yeah. that? The one that looks like fucking olive oil from Popeye. Woof! Oh my God! And did you, I, is, is that is that like is that like? Whoa, man! That that skirt is is very high, and I think I'm seeing like some meat. Are you are you see are you seeing that? Is that just oh, like man. the low, the low res of the image, or is that like whoa? Oh my God! No, no, their their skirts are just. Wow! This is see, I went to Catholic high school. And you know they, they everybody wore uniforms, and when when the girls came in with their uh, their skirts hiked up that high, uh, they would get detention. So I think the beauty fighters are all looking to fucking end up in, in detention here, cause cause listen, th this whole magical girls genre, right? What's the inspiration? They're uh, they're in uh, fucking private school, parochial school, right? Uh, that's why they wear uniforms, right? I think that's like just what they do in Japan. Like he, uh, well, hold on a minute. Do they they have like public schools in Japan? I, the fuck, I don't know what goes on. What goes on there? I'm pretty sure they all wear uniforms. No matter what. Yeah. See, I used to be jealous of the public school kids because they got to walk around like wearing whatever the fuck they wanted. Like they got to wear their um. You know, what, oh, what was cool at the time? Like the UFO pants. Like that kid was wearing in Bayonetta last night. All the cool, trendy clothes. I'm trying to think of some other dumb shit that, like, people were people were, we were wearing in the in the 90s. And I'm drawing up. I, see, I never had to worry about it because I was always in private school. I just fucking had uniforms. I was like, hmm, what do I want to wear today? Oh, I know. The same uniform that I wore for the, pa the past fucking week. That's very cr crusty. That I slept in and fucking binged MMOs in. Without bathing. Yeah, I'm gonna just wear that. Good thing I don't have to think about fashion. I was actually a blessing in disguise now that I think about it. What was that? There was like, uh, jeans, but they were like a meat apron? I think that's the, <sighs> what? the, the meat apron. That's the, 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 yeah, the, yeah, the UFO, apron. the UFO pants. Oh my god, public school is a mistake. Gotta, gotta have, like... Yeah, overalls, overalls, that's what it was, Blackberry. Yeah, overalls. Oh, Jesus. So many people wore that at my school. The meat aprons. Yeah. <laughs> oh, like I love that. The apron that you wear at a butcher plate. Yeah. But in jeans. Oh, man. Chain wallets uh, twisted. Yep, I remember chain wallets. Yeah, I was jealous. Because the public school kids got to wear uh, chain wallets and shit. Uh, you know. I did get to wear my North Face jacket, though. That wasn't an issue. But, oh my god. And I don't think that they're, uh... I don't, I don't think they're wearing pa panties, man. Oh, shit. Take a look at, uh... Sailor Moon's eyes over here. <laughs> It, 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 is she missing one? Why is it again? It's low res, which which sucks. But I mean, the one, yeah, her her uh, her left eye is that an eye patch? What's going on there? Was it just? Did she lose it? In did she lose it in battle? And then uh, did she just fucking left the hole? It's a wink, Star Heaven. Mm -hmm. She's winking at you, Star. What's up, Star? Oh my God, these faces. 
Oh, what happened to the green one? <laughs> no. Oh, man. So it looks like... um. Its head is extended upwards, like Mega Mind or some shit. <laughs> like, like it's got, yeah, it's got just a, a giant growth coming out of the top of its head. Where I, I think that was supposed to be hair, but then when they painted it, um, they just went ahead. They, they made the hair flesh colored, and then they just applied like a little sliver of, of actual hair color to the to the top of it. it you, you're seeing what I'm what I'm looking at here. <laughs> oh God. A massive it looks bungle. Like a baseball cap. Whatever it is, it's it's a fucking medical anomaly. So yeah, the uh the beauty fighters definitely not living up to their name here, huh? God bless him. God fucking bless him. I'm gonna pop that right here. I'm gonna leave all of them up on the screen, because why not? Meridian 5 sees a Lego head with an extra plastic on top. Yeah, she's having a uh, she's having a hard time there, huh? Oof. Uh, woo, what is? All right, so you got another Sailor Moon bootleg. Why the fuck was Sailor Moon so popular to bootleg? This was barely scratching the surface. I just picked the three best ones, but man, there were so many. Well, boy, we we could keep going with that in in the future. Black Bear is saying, yeah. They fight beauty by being hideous. At the, at that point, I'd say that they're doing an outstanding job of living up to their name, yeah. The, yeah, these so these are all, yeah, uh, vintage bootlegs. I don't know if the 80s or early 90s is, is vintage. Would you consider that vintage, Wolf? Do you think that, that like, we're that old? I, I think it counts as that now, yeah. It's, like, almost, what, 30 years now? I'll tell you what makes me feel fucking ancient. I'm listening to, like, you know, the the Dad Rock channel. You know, the Dad Rock radio station we have here. You know, classic rock radio station. Mm -hmm. And it's like, oh, wow. Here's Alice in Chains and, and, and Nirvana and Green Day. And I'm like, oh, oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. oh, I, oh I'm, yeah, I'm, 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 a, I'm a dad. I'm dad aged. I'm in the dad zone. Yeah, it's it's bad. I don't. I do not like hearing that. Like, come on, that's not classic rock. That just that just happens. That can't be classic rock. Oh. Ooh, they yeah. should change the name of the band to Green Dad Carencio. <laughs> so here we go. Another Sailor Moon uh, bootleg. This time it's Planet Girl. And the immediate, uh, the thing that strikes me about being th 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 fucking th outstandingly stupid is that a moon is not a planet. They failed. They failed. But to be fair, okay, so th 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 Sailor Moon's what? Sisters or friends or, or whatever. Um, lesbian, witch, coven, w whatever the, the relationship she has with those, those people. They're named after planets. And she's the only one named after a moon. Right? Yeah. So she she should actually just, you know, I mean, I know this isn't the bootleg's fault, but she she should be called Sailor the Moon at that point. Sailor the Moon. Why is she not Sailor the Moon? Why is she not Sailor Earth? Wait, wait, where the fuck? Where the fuck is Sailor Earth? That's an amazing point, both. Where the fuck is Sailor Earth? Was that mentioned? Was that like you know, the, the, like 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 the Green Ranger and uh, you know, like the, the the first couple of seasons of Power Rangers, where like he didn't show up, but he just dicked around in the background, and everybody was like, "Oh my God, the Green Ranger!" Oh, oh, it's so cool when the Green Ranger finally shows up, and then he showed up too much. They added him to the actual cast, and then people stopped giving a shit about the Green Ranger. So then they had to replace it with the. Uh, the Black Ranger, and then nobody gave a shit about the Black Ranger, and then it became the White Ranger, and then it was the fuck the Magenta Ranger, and it was like, alright guys, alright guys, if you want them to re to retain their mystique, stop demasking them and adding them to the main cast. Because sooner or later, you're gonna run out of colors. Oh, wow, it's... Teal Ranger. Oh, with his... 
wacky flute instrument. And he shows up playing a fucking kazoo. <laughs> turquoise, light turquoise forest green ranger. It's like, all right, you know, come. Salmon ranger. The salmon ranger shows up. It's like, actually, it's not pink. It's salmon. It's salmon. It's very, very masculine color. I'll have you know. It's not pink. It's salmon. For the record, it is salmon. Don't call it pink. You'll make me very upset if you call it pink. Can you look at the hyper-realistic art of uh, Planet Girl going on there? Oh, that, that's what drew me in. I mean, you're talking about... I mean, Liz, I'm not an artist. I've I've dabbled in doodles. I'm a doodle dabbler. But to me, this looks like somebody spent a lot of fucking time on it. Don't compare this to the to, to, to the fucking ugly sisters or whatever the fuck they're called. Sorry, beauty fighters. All right, he's still reeling from the the, the fucking like ten tons of irony that just got dropped on my fucking head. But in any case, she looks great. Um, this is like. If a yeah, if if Sailor Moon was created in the United States or a, a Western country, right? This is an alternate universe where the concept the concept of 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 Sailor Moon was yeah was born in the West and attempted by uh, Western animators. And uh, it's like you know, it reminds me of like you know, Gem, Gem, and the. Uh, Crusty cunts. You, you remember the, the cartoon gem from the 80s? I remember gem, yeah. Which was basically like an American Magical Girls, if you if you ask me. I don't know if it existed prior to the, the you know, the anime, Magical Girls anime, like, uh, phenomenon, but... Gem in the Crystals. Gem in the Cunt Sabers. Gem in the Hologems. Gem in the, the Holocaust. One of these is... is <laughs> one of these is wrong. Vindoji's taking a stab saying Steven Universe. Nice try. Close with no cigar. Gem and the The Meat Curtains. That was that was the name of the the, the, the uh the show. Gem and the Meat Curtains. Hello, jamming slowly. Thanks for coming to hang out tonight. It's just the holograms. It's thank you, Gambling Lucario. Gem and the holograms. Why was this so difficult? Come on, I'm a 90s kid. I'm supposed to know about Gem and the... Only 90s kids remember Gem and the holograms. This is like... Yeah, Sailor Moon and Gem and the holograms, like... Fucked and had a baby. But it's gorgeous. Look at it. Though, uh... I don't know. She's got, um... She's... She's got, like, uh... Cookie monster eyebrows going on. That might that might be the one the one thing that I I, I wouldn't have wouldn't have done. But inter interestingly enough, interestingly enough, dude, do you notice that those fucking eyebrows are in front of her bangs? Yeah, I'm seeing that. They where, seem to be like floating out in front. Where, there. where is the only other place that you you've seen that? Anime. So the person went to the point where they were gonna be like, I'm gonna rip off this this fucking anime. I'm gonna do it, you know, obviously, you know, I, I'm gonna do it in a Western style. I don't know if I don't know if they, they were American or if they were whatever. Maybe they maybe they were Japanese, maybe they were Chinese, but whatever. I'm gonna fucking animate the same characters, all of them, in a Western style. But I'm gonna do it with this. This one aspect of it is gonna remain faithful. The fucking eyebrows are gonna be in front of the bangs. Amazing, amazing. Absolutely fucking incredible. Also, I could see one of the sailor um, sisters' asses. I just wanna throw that out there. And then when you look at the at the, at the toy, <laughs> massive, massive fucking anime eyes. So the entire concept clearly. 
the art direction and the uh, manufacturers were never in contact with each other at any point. Unless this was deliberate, which I doubt. Hey, you know who would really fuck with people? If we made this beautiful Western art, but we slapped the fucking... Yeah, we're, we're going to make an anime uh, rip-off action figure, but, but the art is going to be is going to be totally American-looking. I mean, maybe they were going for, like, a fusion type of thing there. You know, East meets West. Uh, I think the uh, more likely is that nobody involved in this process gave a fuck about anything with the exception of this artist. I mean, fucking, like, shout-out to... Whoever the fuck did this, because I think this is beautiful. I hope that they went on to, to, to do something uh, with their career, because there's, there's a level of talent here that uh, was quite frankly squandered on this. I think. I don't know, maybe I'm off base with this shit. Alright, I'm going to slap that up there. Planet Girl, thank you for that... What felt like 40 minutes of entertainment, Planet Girl. You know, Earth's moon does have a name, in fact. It's, uh, Luna. That's the official, um, yeah, scientific, uh, astrology name for, uh, our fucking moon, Luna. So, yeah, she should have been Sailor, uh, Sailor Luna. Oh, well, Luna's the cat. Oh, yeah. I forgot about that. Sorry, son of a bitch. All right. So there's more bootlegs on the menu here tonight. Hope you guys brought your appetites. Because it's getting fucking stupid. Oh, this is a... I feel like I've seen this one before. But, uh... Does Classic. It, it's, uh, yeah, it's, it's, it doesn't make it any less delightful. Here you go. Big, 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 chew. Big, big. Pigachu, P Pigachu, Pigachu. I wanna, I wanna spell this. I wanna spell this idea that I have for poo. Pigachu, Pigachu, Pigachu. I put it in the chat. That's how my my brain is 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 spelling this right now. All right. So my first instinct is to say that. <laughs> they had, like, a rabbit or, uh, like, a horse. But then again, like, the, 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 the fucking, the thing has toes. Like, are you seeing its toes? Yeah. Uh, I, I know it's rough. I know it's rough to look at, Wolf, but but just, 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 just bear with me for this. What fucking animal was this? Before they decided that, you know, it needed to be a Pikachu instead. Like, what I'm... the fuck creature has feet like that? Like, maybe a... Like, it looks like a... Like, maybe a hippo or, or an elephant or a fucking... Yeah, but, but Mike, look at the mouth. Oh, ew. Oh, no. Oh, that doesn't explain... That, that explains nothing. Is there like a is there like a hole there? Could you like Is there a depth to that? I think there's a depth to that. I think there's a depth. But then, you know, the well, the tail, it has a Pikachu tail. So you're not gonna be able to give it a fucking Pikachu tail with the with a paint job. So was this thing, like, a Pikachu from the beginning? Was it born a Pikachu? Was it always... Was the intention always for it to be a Pikachu? Well, I mean, look at the rest of the ride. Look at the other parts of it. What... What is the theme here? I... Okay, so... I see... <laughs> I see... Fuck, who is that? Is that Snow White? Yeah. I see Snow White hanging out uh, behind the Pikachu. Um... Behind Pikachu, I think I'm seeing... That looks like a Native American uh, dress thing to me. So, I'm gonna I'm gonna say Pocahontas? Yeah. Uh, in front of Pikachu, I kinda... I can't tell what that is. Um... 
So this is, yeah, this is a common theme. When you're looking at, like, theme parks, right? Well, theme, theme, at a theme park. <laughs> Where they're just, um, you know, they're cobbling together a bunch of bootleg shit. I mean, obviously, Jed's Island Resort comes to mind immediately, but... You know, I've, I've seen this, like, with my own two eyes at certain, like, you know, I've fucking, like, festivals, and carnivals, whatever the fuck. Um... Yeah, they just mishmash a bunch of fucking random shit together. And they hope it, uh, you know, it's a draw for the kitties. It's like, hey, kids, but <laughs> we got the, we got the bogey beds, and we got the Disney princesses, and we got the, we got the animals, we got the, well, hey, kids, we got everything, you can have what, we got this, and that, we got, we got, we got Captain Planet, and fucking Sailor Moon, and fucking the bogey beds, and you're sitting there, even a kid, like a fucking, like a grade school age kid is, is gonna see all this, and, and first of all, they, they're, they're gonna know that it, it's not official immediately because look at this fucking thing. And then they're just gonna get like fucking whiplash. They're gonna be overwhelmed by it. They're gonna be like, make up your fucking minds. No fucking child has ever been excited by walking into a fucking theme park, okay, and seeing a monstrosity like this fucking thing, like Pikachu here. All right, lined up, immediately followed by I, I, some kind of dollar store Pocahontas. Sakajui, a half dollar Pocahontas, maybe. If that, if that was, if that was funny, I don't think that was funny. But uh, I think it, yeah. And this is, and this is even scarier. It was always meant to be a Pikachu. It's not a repurposed, you know, the, the fuck rabbit or, you know, just a, a generic whatever animal for the ride. It's a fuck, I, it was always meant to be a Pikachu. And I, I'm, I'm making that argument because of the tail. Chiefly. Um, but how scary is that? Did, is the person blind? Did they know, did they, did they investigate what a fucking Pikachu actually looks like before they tried to fucking make this monstrosity? Oh, you know... If you can zoom in a little bit on the on the skin there above the foot, yeah, like look at that texture. What is going on? Oh there? shit! Computer enhance. Computer enhance again. That's that's like a scaly texture, huh? Like that's, that. a, that's a fucking like a rough skin animal that that could be we could be talking about some kind of lizard at this point a dinosaur we could be talking about a yeah like like actually like a pachyderm right this could be a fucking this could be a yeah, like like a rhino or an elephant i don't think it, the, the, the pachyderm is strictly an elephant isn't it whatever i mean i i, I can't figure out the fuck out because if it, was, if it was an elephant it would have had a trunk And it wouldn't have had that tail. And it wouldn't have had this tail. So, so why did this person? Oh my God! Like maybe it was. A, I need. I need to know what happened here. Like maybe it was. So it was going to be something else, and then they fucking changed their mind halfway through. Like somebody walked in. They were like, "See, the kids like the Pokemon, so instead of making that into an elephant, I'm gonna need you to go ahead and make that a bigger troop." And the guy was like, "Wait, wait, wait. Let's. Fuck. Where's bigger troop?" Like he looked up from his fucking like, half-empty bottle of Jack Daniels while he's sitting there, like painting this thing. Fuck is bigger troop. Why the fuck is that? Pan, bigger troop. Listen, man. My wife just left me. I don't. I don't un even understand what the words coming out of your mouth. You would work with me here. And then the guy was like, "All right, I'll get, I'll get you a picture of a Pikachu, so you know what to make it look like, right?" And then, he, and then, he, and then he came back with um, another bootleg. <laughs> he gave, he came back with somebody else's bootleg. So maybe we're looking at the bootleg of a bootleg at this point. Hey kids, it's me, Pikachu. Come take a ride on me. Hehe, <laughs> won't be weird or anything. It's me, your favorite Pokemon, Pig Pikachu. <laughs> Giving free rides to all the good, the good boys and girls. <laughs> I hate this. 
I hate this. Hold on. Um, I feel like I was ignoring the chat a little bit for a second. I just got lost in this image. It's fucking completely hijacked my attention. I'm sorry, guys. Um, I had meant to, 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 to say thank you to Great Zot for uh, the resub. I did see that. Welcome back to the family, Zot. Zot, I appreciate that, man. Thank you. Um... But wait, there's more. So maybe, th <laughs> maybe this thing is what uh, is what the guy found. Maybe he showed the guy working on the uh, yeah on the on the the vehicle there. This image. <laughs> okay, what is this hell spawn? This is a fucking hell spawn. I'm looking at a hell spawn. No other word for, for, for what this is. It's a fucking, it's like a Furby. But it's a duck. But it's a fucking Pikachu. But it, what happened? What? What happened? It's a duckachu. Ducka, ducka, duckachu. Ducka, ducka. Ducka, ducka, duckachu. Hey, Duckachu, how come you never go inside your pogey ball? <laughs> ducka, 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 because I cannot be controlled. I am the hell spawn of nightmares. Yet, you try to contain me, I will become ten times stronger, and I will eat your fucking soul out through your ass. Ducka, ducka, duckachu, ass. <laughs> I don't like him. I don't like, I don't like his, uh, his wings. So maybe this is like a Psyduck and a Pikachu fucked. I mean, if you want to, if you want to just give it, you know, like the benefit of the doubt for a second, which I don't. It's got the round body. It's got. Yeah, I mean. It's got the feet. It's got the wings, the, the head shape. It's like, it's like a, it's like a Psyduck. It's like a Psyduck and a Pikachu combo. Pikaduck. Or Psychu. I just sat you out. Thank you for the uh, resub, Cody Apocalypse. Welcome back to the family. Ducka ducka. <laughs> this is an offense to the ducky industry. Thick Dinkman wants it to eat their ass. Are you sure about that? I feel like I feel like you're gonna catch the uh, the pokerist if you let that shit go down. Wolf, would you let the uh, would you let Duckachu? Um, Give you the pokey, the pokey pokey. Oh, I don't know. Look at that thing's face. It's seen some shit, man. It's got that thousand yard stare. <laughs> it's definitely, yeah. Oh my god. Yeah, I seen shit that'll turn your fucking chest hair white. I seen shit that'll make your nipples grow hair. I seen shit that'll put the fear of God into your meaningless little existence. <laughs> I really don't like this. How long should I leave this on the screen for? Oh, man. Put it transparent so it's always looking at you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Hey, Tim! Tim! Hey, Tim! Tim, hey! Daddy, me, Duck Tactive big Pikachu! Duck Tactive! I had a, a flash of genius! A flash of genius, Tom! Tom! The flash of genius! We're gonna solve the crime, Tom. We're gonna solve the crime, and then they're gonna do the, 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 the time, Tom. They're gonna do the time, Tom. They're gonna pay for their transgressions, Tom. You want me to make it transparent in the in the profile picture? Medmus says. What profile picture? Hold on a second. This is a mess. This is a mess. 
I still think I'd rather play de uh, Duck Detective Pikachu than, than Detective Pikachu. Whatever fucking hell it is, it can't be worse than the game that I actually did play. By the way, you guys enjoying the image that I selected? You, you notice how it's like a, a landfill on fire? Let's just say that wasn't an accident. All right, what else you got for me, Wolf? Woo! Oh, this one. Oh, this is. Oh, this one makes me angry. This one makes me angry, and I think I think you know why. Um. So, you all are gonna remember when um you know Pokemon Go became like an overnight global phenomenon. And everybody shit their fucking pants. They're like, we gotta horn in on that Pokemon Go action. Jeff, we gotta horn in on it, Jeff. Fire up the bootleg machine. I like to think that these bootleggers, they have access to, like... Like, it, it, it's not... Because, because again, you know, very, very seldomly does actual creativity go into any of these things. So I think that there's just, like, a machine. Like, an all-purpose machine that's just a bootleg machine. And it just sits there and it just cranks out bootleg shit. It's like this wondrous kind of Willy Wonka-esque type of a fucking thing. Like, it's magical. Like, it is. It's, it's, it's just a thing to behold. You know, there's like a song when people turn it on. You know, there's a whole thing like the Oompa Loompas come out. They, they, they do a dance. Bootleg, bootleg, poopity, boo. We're going to steal an IP to make poo. Bootleg, bootleg, poopity, boo. We're going to rip off you, who, who. That didn't work very well. I, I apologize. Um. So they cranked up the bootleg machine. You know, I, I, it's kind of like a, a big wacky wood chipper type of thing in my mind. They, you know what? They give it more like something from Doctor Seuss. Like a big wacky Dr. Dr. Seuss machine and somebody needs to like fucking sit on it and then like it, it's like a bicycle and they have to pedal it to like make the bootlegs happen. So they put in a bunch of official merchandise in the top of the bootleg machine like with the wood chipper area. And then they crank it out. And then uh, yeah you just get like a disgusting amalgamation of sausage material that comes out the other side. Overcooked has just resub. Welcome back to the family cooked. So yeah, everybody wanted to hop on on the global Pokemon Go phenomenon. And um Pokemon Go was a cell phone app. It wasn't anything else. It wasn't a game. It wasn't there there it had nothing to do with cards. I mean, correct me if I'm wrong, Wolf, but I don't. I don't think that the, the, the Pokemon Go had that had any any merchandise. I don't. It didn't have clothes. It didn't have. So these people thought that Pokemon Go like was t t Pokemon. I, I I don't know what they thought. I think I'm trying to get into the psychology of the of the bootlegger at this point. Maybe I'm giving them too much credit in saying like that that, that there was a psychology at all. But obviously, oh, I, I think yeah. Go ahead. I, I think I know what happened. Here. What happened? They they said, the the kids are going to be playing the Pokemon Go. Grandma's going to want to get them something for Christmas. That's, the, that's, yes. Let's get them Pokemon Go. So, this is what the game of a bootlegger is. It's preying on ignorance. It's, pre actually, no. It's two things. It's preying on ignorance. The idea that somebody might be fooled into thinking they're purchasing a yeah a, a fucking official product like grandma okay or it's uh it's preying on people who maybe can't afford the official official merchandise but i kind of feel like you know if i was a kid and you know somebody came home with you know th 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 this fucking thing for example fuck you know, Grandma came home with this thing. Was like, Sonny, I know you like the Pikachu. I, I heard you talking about the Pikachu, so I went ahead and I, I bought you a Pikachu. Merry, Merry Christmas, sweetie. I'd look at my, I'd look at Grandma and I'd say, I actually would prefer that you didn't buy me anything. <laughs> Fucking nothing. The gift of nothing would have been preferable to this fucking abomination 
Because what the fuck, Grandma? Like, what if my friends see that? Then what? You want me to be the laughing stock of the school, Grandma? Is that what you want? You want me to be the laughing stock of, of my friends? It's her plan. Ghoul Fang Man says, I thank her because she clearly loves me enough to get me a gift, you fucking bastard. Well, I mean, again, like... I, okay, well, I'll tell you what. I, I wouldn't say that to Grandma. But I would think it. Because it is... Okay, it's the thought that counts, to be fair. Right? I'm not an asshole. I'm not an asshole. But... I mean... Yeah, like, you know what? Save your money. Like, even child me would have been like, if you're not gonna get me the fucking- if, if you can't get me the official merchandise, well, don't get me anything. Save the money so maybe you can get me the official one. I don't know, I feel like y y no kid is gonna be, like, you know, filled with joy when Grandma brings home the Pokemon Go Plus. Whatever the fuck this is. Well, Sonny. I heard you talking about the Pokemon Go, so I, I bought you the Pokemon Go. And then, I mean, yeah, like, what are you even gonna do? You're gonna sit there, you're gonna be like, Grandma, po Pokemon Go is a, is, a, is, a, is a cell phone app. All the kids are talking about the Pokemon Go, so I don't want to hear you talking about no, no, no faps. I don't know nothing about no faps. It's apps, Grandma. It's not, it's not faps. All right, don't repeat that to anybody else, please. Uh, LP Leonator's theory is that, you know, it's for dumb children that can't tell the difference. I don't know, man. I, I feel like... I, well, I, well, you're talking about age at that point. So maybe if the kid's under, like, three years old... And they don't give a fuck... They have no idea what it is that they're playing with. They have no concept of, of yeah, Pokemon as, like, an entity or anything like that. It's just a shape, a brightly colored shape in their fucking hand, then I guess. But once you get to a certain age, you're gonna be kind of, you know, you're, you're gonna be embarrassed. Or, I, I, I don't know, I don't know too many kids who are, who are gonna feel like they, they, they'd be, they'd be grateful to get something like this. Am I being an asshole here, Wolf? I mean, you know, call me out if you think of being an asshole. Uh, I actually got a bunch of bootleg toys as a little kid. You did? <laughs> I remember I liked them a lot because my brain was like, "Oh, I got a Pikachu." Okay. Even though it was fat and completely wrong. Go get that seat. Okay, but here's my my next question: Were you were you old enough to be like to reason out that the whole the whole concept of it not being official merchandise at that no, at that time? I, I, th I thought at that time if they were selling it, it had to be the real deal. That was how like yeah, your, your, your brain worked at the time. Do, yeah. do you think, though, that if you were aware of that, right, you would have been bothered by it? Or you would have been like, you know, I don't give I don't give a shit. You know, I don't give a shit that it's not official. I could care less. Well, now that I think about it, that's probably why I like so much trash. Now. <laughs> yeah, it, 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 it fucked you up. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Oh, my God. Well, we do need to. Uh... That was going to be my next point, actually, Black Bear. You know, you, you, th this is not a gift for a fucking for for a child who's not old enough to be aware of that that bootlegs as a concept, because they choke on these fucking things. Let's look at this shit. We got. Uh... Oh God, I can't even tell what half of these are. Fuck. Ooh, what's this? Uh, this this frog looking guy. Right underneath the uh, blue dinosaur. Fuck. I I know those. They're very close to official Pokemon. I know that. That's gonna be like Krogong. It's like a pot. There's some. There's some generations that I'm not too familiar with going on here. Uh, yeah. It's they're also <laughs> they're also coated with uh, with lead paint. Platypus Nuggets. Yeah. What's up, <laughs> Nuggets? Thanks for coming tonight. I mean, listen. Nothing but 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 lead paint for bootlegs. I mean, only the finest for bootleg merch. Rakeman Industries also resub. Well, back to the family. We're just looking at bootlegs, Rakeman. That's it. That's the stream. No games. No video games. We're just looking at bootlegs. I hope you enjoy it. Because I'm having a fucking grand old time. I don't know, I don't know about you, Wolf, but I, I'm, I'm, this is, I'm in my glory right now. Oh, time for you to see the next one. I like, uh, the Lugia down here. L Lungia. 
I shall name him Lungia. Lungia. Lug no. Lugia. As in like when you hawk a loogie like... <sighs> because that's what that fucking thing like makes me think of when I look at it. Lugia. Even though that's how you pronounce it. Thank you for uh, coming tonight, Lava Pit, dude. Hope you're having a good night. We also have... Um... Whoop, hang out. OBS is doing a stupid thing. We have a very, uh, very stout, very stocky, very angry Pikachu here. Um, and also, uh, his evolution... Oh, taller, happier, noseless Pikachu. But you will notice that um, neither of these two Pikachus has a tail. However, the manufacturers, uh, they did, you know, they did anticipate this, this, this being an issue. And they did include a detachable Pikachu tail. That, you know what, fuck it, you could pop on any of the Pokemon that you want. How's that for a good fucking time? I would have had a blast with that as, as a kid, actually. Maybe this is one of those Pikachu tail butt plugs I keep hearing so much about from my chat. Oh, no. Yeah. Yeah, shit, you could put it on Misty if you want. By the way, what's going on with that, Misty? Not looking too good. Hey, Ash, it's, it's me. Do we? What would a bootleg Misty's name be? Dewey or Foggy? I like Foggy. Hey, Ash, it's me, Foggy. R remember me, your old friend, Foggy? Let's go hang out with Cock. Who is, of course, the bootleg Brock. I'm just gonna call him Cock. Like, fuck it. Like, I'm done with subtlety here. His name's just Cock. The douchebag city gym leader, Cock. Or Croc. Croc works too, like Croc of shit. In a lot of ways, you could go with that. Mushy? Musty. <laughs> musty! <laughs> oh, now Musty's good. Yeah, Musty is good. Yeah, yeah. Oh, wow, Brock. What's that smell? Whoa, what the heck? Ah, oh, Ash. Looks like Musty's back from the gym. The literal gym, not the Pokemon gym. Like, she just fucking came back from an hour on the elliptical. Oh, hey, I hate wonder what Musty's musk smells like. Ha ha. Ha 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 ha. Ha 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 is this rabbit a, a, a Pokemon? Because I, I feel like it, it's, it's, it, it, it can't be. It has to be. It's on that Pokemon Go box. Oh, shit. Stupid me. It, it, it wouldn't be here if it wasn't a Pokemon. I mean, what the fuck? Oh, my God. What? It, it, seriously, though, is there a Pokemon that even, like, remotely resembles this fucking thing? No. Nah, right? Like, nah. No. No. Oh, man. Yeah, he's got like uh he's got pants on. He's rocking a uh Yeah, he's rocking like an exercise headband, like a sweatband, you know, on his on, on his forehead, maybe, you know. His eyes are also very, very, very um, you know, asymmetrical. You, you seeing that? Yeah, it's, it's fine. I'm 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 having a problem with that. Uh yeah. Ooh, man. Uh sorry, uh Kotaku uh, article today, actually, um, about all the rejected Pokemon over the years. I don't know if you uh, if you caught that. Uh, I think I might have seen that. And they got like a, a um, you know, a, like, I don't know, a exclusive story with Game Freak. I, I have no fucking idea. I feel like they actually this is not the first time I saw this story or talked about this, but whatever. I saw it again today, and um, fans were taking cracks at you know doing um, you know art of all the rejected. Pokemon over the years. You got like what, like seven generations that that Oma pretty much all had um, you know, rejects. Um maybe yeah, maybe this is a reject. Maybe this is um, you know, maybe these uh, these manufacturers where you like you did. Yeah. 
Maybe they got fired from the from Game Freak and they took their designs elsewhere. They had too many rejected designs. They were like, I quit. I'm gonna go start my own Pokemon with hookers and blackjack. Maybe that's what we're looking at. I mean, who the fuck knows? It's just it's a wide world with lots of possibilities. Gonark's mind reset. Well, back to the family, Gonark. It could be a shiny Bunnelby, the only rabbit Pokemon that's remotely white. I, I, the eyes are feeling like they're not very Pokemon-esque. We should name this thing. What should we name this? He needs a Pokemon name. Oh, that's tough. Yeah, so think about something, you know, like, how do they usually come up with names of Pokemon? Something that's... I use, like, a, like, kind of like a not pun, right? Something to do with, you know, what the Pokemon is about. Some combination of like what animal it's 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 emulating and whatever you know fucking element it is, right? You want me to just call it Bun Time Meridian Five? You know what? I like Bun Time. Chat has some ideas. Mistake. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> King Iron Chin. Cuckle. It doesn't cuckle exist already. Shuckle. Hopper Bit. Fitness Rabbit. Battle Bun, Bun Boodle, Booty, Jabrapi. Oh, that's good. Bunglany. Bunglebee? What about Bunglebee? Like with a Y at the end, Bunglebee. Rampart. Thumpy. Velveteen, Calmel. Getting creative with it. The Velveteen Rabbit, of course. Uh, Burgerny. Jump aerobic. <laughs> yeah, because it is. Yeah, it's an exercise rabbit. So we need like I'm liking the ones that are in the exercise rabbit zone. Jim cunt. <laughs> oh, jump aerobic nuke is feeling like it's in it's in like the area that I am where my mind is. Uh, also, Dark Guy gifted a sub to Snow Pixies. Welcome to the family, Pixies. Dark Guy, thank you for that gift there. Bobble Thump, Carrot, Bonaby, Disco Cuck. <laughs> Wait, that was the disco. Uh, Fat Nuts. It's a silent G. Fat Nuts. Yeah, yeah, good. Yeah, good, good. Rab Fit, Mutan. Not bad. Peace. <laughs> Peace, so shit. Oh, yeah. Lots of good ones. Lots of good ones. Uh, we got some more bootlegs. Let's move on from this shit show. I mean, oh. I don't know. It, it, it feels like we got to at least point out the gross looking Electabuzz thing. Like, the, 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 yeah, like, the, I, I just needed to get that out. Like, I don't think I missed this, is what, basically what I'm going to say. <sighs> Fuck. Somebody definitely had a buzz going when they fucking came up with that Electabuzz. I want you to have to click this one to see it. Uh, Wolf said in the chat. Okay. I'll bite. <laughs> Links are spoopy. Thank you, Discord. I'm an adult, Discord. <laughs> <laughs> yeah! Oh, no! <laughs> oh, my God! Woof! All right, hold hold on. Uh, <laughs> wow, what fucking what circle of hell did you fucking drag this thing up from? Holy shit! <laughs> can you smell it, Ghoulfang? Can you smell? Can you smell the must? Musty is back, and she eggs through Musty. Oh yeah. So, whoo, we got, we got a lot going on here, man. I don't, I don't even, oh, I don't even know where to start. Maybe, maybe the eyes, the soulless fucking eyes. Holy shit. Like what, what have we done to deserve this? Like as a human race, like we fucked up, Wolf. We fucked up bad. <laughs> this is, this is punishment is what this is. We're being punished. You know that, right? 
<laughs> oh, hubris! God. Hubris! So, you, 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 you got, I guess Misty, maybe she's trying out to join the, um, the beauty fighters? Maybe this is, maybe this is her, you know, putting on her, you know, her worst face to try to get on the old uh, beauty fighters team there. What do you think? Oh, man, she could lead them. She could lead them, yeah. She would definitely fit in with the pack. I mean, no, no question. But you notice how around the mouth is is very red. Why is it why is it why is it red like that? I mean obviously they fucked up the paint job. Or am I seeing that wrong? Is it just like a weird shadow? What what why is that? Because my mind went to like she's she's fucking like eating human flesh. And she's getting it all over, you know, all over her face. Like, she's eating, like, human hearts and just, like, you know, not using napkins. Like, fucking, did you, did you watch Game of Thrones? I don't know if it's a spoiler, but, you know, Daenerys Targaryen, like, becoming Dothraki and eating the, uh, and eating the horse heart. Like, that's, that, for some reason, that's where my mind immediately, immediately went. Like, some kind of pagan ritual where, like, Musty's gotta, like, eat a heart to become, like, a fucking, a, a gym leader, I guess. This is oh, the old, the alternate world of, of... Porger men. The alternate universe of Porger men. Oh, it's a very twisted place. Just gonna do a slow, like, you know, scan and just kind of scope out. Oh, yeah. <laughs> is, uh... I'm not sure if, if this is an attempt at, like, tits, or if, um, if her head is on backwards. Head on backwards. <laughs> from from how the 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 pants look, it it might be backwards. Yeah, this is uh yeah, this is old musty. Need an exorcism. Oh god, the eye dots. Ash, your mother sucks dicks in hell. Yeah, those eye dots are rough. Oh my god, what is like? her flesh made out of what why is she like a goo why is she like why is she melty <laughs> why is she gelatinous what is this is this is this is she's a slime girl what material is this is this this figure made from oh god nightmares it's made from nightmares and why are her legs so short oh shit just chat do you think this is edible this could be fucking edible, Wolf. I oh I don't know, man. This Would could you want to eat that? I fucking certainly yeah. I I mean maybe if I was feeling like particularly suicidal, I might wanna I might wanna try it. Um, this will kill you. I mean, and let me do a public service annou announcement, please. No, no matter how good you think this may or may not taste, don't put it in your mouth. Because at the very least, it's it's not made out of organic matter. And in that case, you definitely have lead poisoning. <laughs> you got guaranteed lead poisoning if you do that. Holy fuck. Um, I also... OBS is doing a... I'm having a fucking time with OBS right now. What are you what are you doing to me, man? I don't think I could keep all these images on the screen. I think it makes OBS shit itself if I do that. Yeah, OBS is Yeah, OBS is really fucking like shit in the bed hard right now. I gotta clean up I gotta clean this up. So I guess I can't I never never ran into that problem before, so I don't know what the fuck that's about. <laughs> oh my god. Oh whoa. Um, I just wanted to, I, 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 I needed to address, that is a very interesting boot, like, now I'm very excited for it, but I needed to just, I wasn't done with this one. One quick thing that I had, uh, I had spied. You need to take a very, very, very close look at these characters down here. You need to take a very close look at Misty, Ash. And, uh, and Team Rocket here, and J James there. Are you are you seeing the um? 
something is just off, huh? Yeah, G Gems is, is looking a little bit, uh, a little balloon heady. Something's just off, man. I, I, I can't, I can't put my finger on it. Um, it, it's, how the fuck do I, oh, fuck. It's like when you meet somebody's doppelganger, and you're like, oh shit, that looks exactly like so-and-so, except his eyes are like, maybe like one inch, like a centimeter too far apart, or something like that. Or their forehead is just slightly bigger than the than the person that it's a, it's a doppelganger of, right? Yeah, it's like the bootlegger almost nailed it. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's... They did good work, but at the end, we were still able to detect the bullshit. Like, we, we could still, like, you know, we still knew we weren't looking at, you know, the official fucking art. But, God, that's, that's, that's insidious. That's insidious. Mullet Muffins, what's up? We're just looking at bootlegs. That's all it is. Speaking of which, got a real fucking sexy one for you guys here. I know you're going to enjoy it. But you know what? I think I'm gonna pee first. Uh, you gotta do some, um, some, some pee pees, some poopies, both. How you feeling? You good on, you good on, um, BMs? I'm, I'm good. You're good. Uh, I'm gonna just, um, yeah, I'm gonna drain the lizard a little bit. I'm gonna drain the lizard. I'm gonna drain the lizard. By the way, where the fuck did that, that expression come from? Your ah. lizard begin to show. It's like... Did somebody's fucking, like, dick have, have legs? They were like, you know, it kind of looks like a lizard. I'm just gonna call it a lizard. Use that euphemism. Drain the lizard. Should it be drain the snake? Drain the snake. Drain the, drain the, drain the worm. Drain, drain the eel. Yeah. One of the greatest questions of our time. I'm gonna be right back. <laughs> I have returned. 
Hello, everyone. Both. I had you. I had you muted. So I didn't hear. I, I didn't hear you if, you if you said anything. <laughs> so how you feeling? How you feeling about these about these uh, these bootlegs? You regret this yet? I don't know. I'm loving this. Mm -hmm. Well, I think you're actually about to about to regret it. Hey, it's me, Marlo, and this is my prize, Antoni. Antoni Marlo and Marlo Marlo. Okie dokie, here we go. I wanted to tell you that we do the home improvement. We are not plumbers, but we can do it if you want. We can clean up the poop and the pee pee. If you need to clean the pee pee, we can do that. But it's not really the, uh, the specialty. We do uh, carpentry, more, mainly is carpentry. We give you the wood. If you write a good review on Angie's list, my brother Anthony will uh, suck you penis. Okay, what do you think? You want to hire the Marlow Brothers or do you want to die? <laughs> Okie we come to bring our sidekicks to these are apprentices for the business that we do, me and my brother Antoni. We have a, as you can see, it's a Goomba. It's a Goomba with the head. <laughs> with the lampshade on his head for some fucking reason that I don't, I don't comprehend. Why does he have the lampshade on his head? Oh, it's a toad! <laughs> that's the, that's what you saw, Articus? You saw toad? Oh, I didn't know what the fuck I was looking at. Oh, mamma mia! Mamma mia! Oh, goodness gracious! I did rehearse, I rehearsed the voice a little, a little bit, SMG. Yeah, I did, I did, while I was peeing. And I peed sitting down. Oh my god. Wow, what did you look at it? What did you look at it, the toad? Where's his face? Where do you see the face? It it is it, it's a like a um I don't know what the fuck they're called, e e Ether Man. I, I I always thought it was like a rice hat, but I think even calling it a rice hat is racist. I have no fucking idea. If it's not racist, it's it's at least racist. Should I? You know what? I'm very. You know what? I'm. I'm very proud of that one. <laughs> it was kind of a bootleg rim shot because the the fucking drum kit the drum kit's like not set up right right now. But you know what? How appropriate. Okie dokie, so we're going to fix it, the plumbing. I already forgot the, vo the voice. I don't even remember. <laughs> I don't even remember the voice I was doing now. <laughs> oh, man, me, me, er. Oh, would you look at this? Oh, my God, it's a Koopa. A Koopa Troopa. Are you... Are you seeing the... Are you seeing the, the toes? My parents feet like that. You see in the feet? You see in the you see in them you see in those feet, right? Oh god. It's like a fetish thing. <laughs> it is! Are you seeing Yoshi, Etherman? Me and my brother Anthony, we're gonna fix your plumbing and we're gonna bring our dinosaur, Josh. Joshua. We're just gonna call him Joshua, fuck it. 
Fuck it. We use his tongue as the snack to clean your poopy tubes. I mean to put it in the toilet to clear out the blockage, but he also gonna put it in your asshole too if you wanted that, but that's gonna cost extra. <laughs> Here we go. I fucking hate this. Why is Mario also like fucking drenched in cum? Well, look at his mouth again. Oh. Same shit that the Pikachu oh, had. Oh, oh, no. Well, I mean, you know what? You know what? This honestly, this this fucking reeks of maybe not being like honest. You know what I mean? This reeks of maybe like I could, could somebody have like de deliberately made these like to be an asshole? Oh, maybe. Like, cause, cause I mean, like this is too good. Like this is, I, I, and I, you know what I mean by that? Like it's too bad. Yeah. To be to be done honestly, like this is this is fucking this is bad. Like this is bad. And it's like it's almost like it's one of those. It, it feels too good to be true, and when it's too good to be true, it feels too good to be true. It probably is too good to be true. Illegitimate gamer is saying they look like the old claymation Christmas. Week. Yeah, like uh, oh fucking rank rank and rank and bass rank and file whatever whatever the fuck the name the animator's name was. But they do look like that. Like you remember the Jack Frost and the, the fuck the snow the, the snowman and the god the, the, the gabagool whatever the fuck. Remember that? And the uh, the, the, the Frosty the snowman and the the, the Santa Claus and the, the, the Rudolph. They do look like that. They do. Yeah. Yeah. You know what the com the cum is just a very poor paint job. Also the uh, yeah. My brother Anthony, he mow he mowed the lawns. He mowed the lawns. That's why he have the green on his shoe. He does the landscaping. I do the carpentry. Okay, dokie, you find us on Angie's list. Uh, we very good, very good contractors. We don't fuck your wife. No, 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 no. We not gonna fuck your wife. We don't do that. Okay, dokie, we don't know how to do that. We don't do that. We fix it the plumbing, not your wife's plumbing, okay, Anthony? Anthony, one time he fucked the customer's wife, and then we have to have a talk. But after that, he been pretty good. Uh, the worst he did last time was he jacked off into the bed. He's not gonna do that this time, though. But you gotta admit, it's better than if he fuck your wife. So you should probably hire us right now. The mustaches are vile, by the way. I really don't like these mustaches. Oh, fuck. It's like somebody tried to, like, they, they tried to shave, but it was a botch job. And I mean, you, you gotta, like, you gotta respect Luigi's mouth. Are you, am I, am I seeing this right? He's got, like, a, like, a Muppet mouth? Oh, maybe. Yeah. Uh, oh, Jesus. I didn't he, even think of it that way. He, yeah, he's got like a Pac-Man mouth type of thing, it looks like. Holy fucking shit. That's very uncool. It looks like a bird shit on his on his shoulder. <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, he's a landscaper. It's 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 gonna happen. <laughs> his eyes are two different colors too. You see, you, you see that? Well, they're different shapes. They're different shapes. Ah, <laughs> oh, fuck Mario's. I, I didn't look at Mario's eyes too. Oh, this is delightful. This is what I'm saying. Like, the lack of effort is so it's so extreme that it almost feels like there was an effort put to to make them worse. I can guarantee you, if I go to the dollar store, at, like in the town next door, I could find these there. I, I can guarantee you, really? I've seen really? this like, level of shit. Really? Oh, that's, that's yeah. I, I, I like that. Oh my god. Is it this almost Mario's outfit when he gets the fire flower? It's almost like Testicle Wars saying, I like how the ears are different sizes and shape. It's almost like somebody put these in the microwave. <laughs> like maybe they like they weren't you know they were never obviously good but they you know they they were never gonna convince anybody to begin with but then somebody put them in the fucking microwave holy fucking shit 
<laughs> Look at that. Oh my god, I could fucking stare at this all night. We're not gonna do that though. <clears throat> we have other bootlegs to get to. What is that turtle? Oh my god. Alright, so we got uh we got some more some more Pokemon inbound here. We got what wait a minute. Hmm. Not quite Pokemon. Now th this looks like it's not even attempting to, to, to pass itself off as Pokemon. It's obviously trying to cash in on the popularity, but it it, ne it never claimed that it was that it was Pokemon. It looks like it's um it's calling itself Digimon instead. That's what that says in um in Japanese there. It says Digimon. <laughs> Digimon, I've never heard of. of it's surely the most vile Pokemon bootleg ever ever born. Yeah, there he is, Agumon. There he is, right there. I'm joking, of course. It says it's Korean. I had a feeling it was Korean. You notice how I paused before I said Japanese? Because I had I had a suspicion it was it was actually Korean, but then I was like, you know, I'm fucking fuck it, fuck it. If I'm wrong, I'm wrong. Nobody expects me to be right. Fuck it. It says, my friend monster, my friend monster. Alright, and this is um, everybody's favorite uh, monster from the uh, my, F my friend monster um, franchise. It's, uh, it's number, it's actually number, I believe it's number 32. Pokemon number 32, and uh, his name is Yellow. It's like, could be a Pikachu pre-evolution. Like, this could be the thing that's between Pichu and, and Pikachu. However, notice the uh, the black markings have been taken off of the uh, the, the fur. He's and just, the tail. he's just straight P. Brings a whole new meaning to Pikachu. <laughs> They gave him, uh, yeah, they replaced his elect lightning bolt fucking tail with, like, a man bun. <laughs> I guess. And, uh, they gave him a white, a white tummy. And it's also that, you know, that earlier version of Pikachu where he's, like, you know, he's, he's, like, he's plumper. And then they, uh, they, they completely changed his face. They completely changed his face. My friend monster, yellow. This peak, th this Pokemon's special attack is paralyzed, but it paralyzes your soul. It paralyzes your fucking soul right down to its core by fucking staring at you vacantly. And let me tell you something, there there ain't no fucking cure for that shit. You ain't gonna find that in your fucking your bag of tricks there. Look at this. My friend monster. Um, so it's, uh, oh boy, it's Blastoise, but he's a mammal now, or he's both. He's a turtle, but he's got, like, fox ears. Kind of reminds me of Bayonetta when she put on the fox, uh, the fox costume last night. <laughs> he's, uh, he's got mammalian ears, which... I don't even, like, how, how often does Pokemon, like, the official Pokemon, fuck with, with like, things like that? Mixing and matching, like, is there, is there like, a, the, the, I don't know, like a bear fish or something? Do they, do they fuck around like that? I feel like they don't very often. I don't think they do. Not really, right? This is, this is a new, this is a new frontier. Uh, oh, fuck, absolute in ink, ink sanity. Hello, absolute ins ink sanity. Thanks for coming tonight. Has a great point. The original Blastoise does, in fact, have cat ears. That's right. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, it does. Yeah, it does. Fuck. Motherfucker. Wow. So they do do it. <laughs> so what they did here was they completely stripped Blastoise of his, you know, his, his fucking guns, stripped him of his, of his fucking Second Amendment right, and then fucking inflated his ears. So now he's a fucking gunless... 
turtle mammal thing with a really, really good sense of hearing. Which opens up a whole new realm of possibilities for old Blastoise. It's probably for the best, though. I feel like the giant cannon things were probably, like, a source of considerable back pain. Imagine having to lug those fucking things around all the time. Well, yeah, that's why he was always hunched over. Were they part of his body? I think, I think in the show, like, he could make them pop out. They're metal, though. You look at them, they're fucking metal. They're not, like, Fuck. flesh. They're not flesh cannons. They're not flesh cannons. Well, as far as we know, they might be, because, I mean, you got, like, the Pokemon that look like they're wearing clothes, but that's just their skin. But why is it metal, then? So you're telling me if Maybe I walked up to like... Blastoise, right, and I and I poked one of his water cannons, would it be, like, squishy? I'm thinking that's what it would be. Maybe... Maybe, but I don't like that. Maybe it's me. Maybe it's made out of the, like the, like the, whatever the fuck that the shell is made out of. It's not the same color as the shell. It's not, though. It's not. My BB cannons. Well, hi there, Michael. <laughs> you want to touch my beat cannons? Well, <laughs> don't be shy. Go ahead. Go ahead. Give him a poke. <laughs> Everybody's curious about my beat cannons, Michael. Just give it a little stroke. Stroke it a poke. <laughs> Nothing weird going on here, no sir. <laughs> I wouldn't blast toy with you. <laughs> no sir me. Hmm. Now give it a jerk. Give the beat cat it a quick jerk. Let's not do that. So we have another um my friend monster. It looks like Dragonite. But um uh, if Dragonite I don't know, man, was was born with, like, a very fucking, like, like physically deformed, like, everything. I don't even, I don't know if there's, like, a medical condition that describes what this is. Like, I, I, I'm not a doctor. Um, but I'm seeing, like, yeah, this is, this is bad news. This is bad fucking news. This is bad fucking news. This thing, I I don't know if there, I don't know if there's help for for, for this thing. By the way, uh, his, his name is Red. It's a Coke baby. <laughs> yeah, yeah, indie film. It's Coke baby Dragonite. Wow, they you know they told this fucking thing. The fucking mother was just smoking and drinking. They're like, hey, can you can you can you stop your your fucking like. You're 10 months pregnant. You need to stop. She's like, fuck you. Fuck you. I live my own life. Fuck you. Is that a wing back there? What the fuck is behind it? I don't know, man. That has to be its wing. I mean, this is like the bootleg Charizard. So. Bargonite. Bargonite. Bargon. Bargon. Bargonite. Bargon. Bargon. This is an ap appropriate time, I think, to whip out the Dargan. Nah, nah, you know, nah, you know what this calls for? Bagron. Ah, Bagronite, 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 Dag, Dag, Dagron, Dagronite. He's also got a condom on his tail. Why is there a, like a, a, a condom? What is on his tail? Oh no. He's got like a sheath on, on his tail. Woo! Oh man. Let me see if hold on, I want to spell this for everybody. The name of this Pokemon. Dagronite. How could we make that worse? Da Dangronite. Oh, I like that too. Dangr Dangr Dangronite. No, you know what? My fuck, like your, like their finger slipped and it hit the R, which is next to T. So now his name is Bangranier, 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 Bangranier. And then finally, you got uh Silver. I guess these these are actually the fucking like the, 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 they're not the names of the Pokemon. I'm realizing they're the names of like you know the games. 
Because, you know, whatever the fuck this is, it's it's entire games, right? So here's your, 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 um, my, f my friend monster blue, my friend monster yellow, uh, red, and, and silver. Yeah, because they went that far to make all these separate games. Do you think that these actually exist, or this, this whole image is just horseshit? Oh, I bet this is some kind of toy you can get. It's not games. It's just a fucking toy. It's stickers? It might just be fucking stickers. This thing actually kind of reminds me of that motherfucker with the bananas growing from his from his neck that we were looking at. Oh, Tropius. Tropi Tropius. Um, yeah. The green plant plant wings. Um, black soulless eyes. Just one. This is a little hard to see, so I gotta I gotta dig in here. Fuck. Just one very horribly misshapen hand. Okay. Oh, that's my strong hand. That's his strong hand. And then the other, it looks like, I don't know, maybe it's the resolution, but it looks like the other arm is coming out of his neck. And that one has a, ti a tiny hand. Do we have a name for this guy? This thing needs a name. So if it's a Tropius, it's a Tropius, but it's also a, uh, he does a lot, yeah, Ramku, he skips left arm day, or right, he skips right arm day at the gym. Copius, deep throat turtle, what's up, Polis, thanks for coming tonight. Yeah, the tiny left hand. Can we find a way to work in, like, the malformed hands that this, that this guy's rocking? Scumblo. Trocyphilus, Kivy Cat. Nice. Copazard. Slowbloke. Diplopius. Toptrius. Cankelfist. Oh, I like Cankelfist. I like Cankelfist, yeah. Trogdor. Nice. The sick reference, bro. Please end me. <laughs> no, the po- Alright, the Pokemon's name is Kill Me. Kill me, kill me, kill me, kill me, kill me, kill me. Like, that's the only thing it can say. It just walks around saying kill me. But it's spelled like this. <laughs> it's spelled like that. <laughs> K-I-L-L-M-Y. Kill me, kill me. Please kill me, kill me. Did it- th Hey, Ash, did your Pokemon just say, please kill me? No, his name's Kill Me. He loves being alive. <laughs> just look at him. <laughs> look how he limps. And look how he can't control his bowels. <laughs> look how there's a constant stream of saliva coming out of his mouth. <laughs> that might be b b spinal fluid. But, <laughs> but look, he just loves life. He's, he's great. Kill me, kill me, kill me, kill me. Holy fucking shit. Send this one back to the lab. You took it out of the fucking oven too early. I don't know why it's Sonic Meridian 5. Don't, don't, just leave, leave me alone. All right, so there's your, uh, oh, you got another one that you want me to? Oh, wait, no. So that's it. We're done. Oh, no. Oh, no. I've got, I've got two more for you. Okay. The fucking anticipation is killing me. This is like Christmas for me. I'm chomping at the fucking bit here. Whoa! <laughs> <laughs> what? Yes! Oh my god, yes! <laughs> <laughs> Whoa! Wait a second! What? No! Oh, yeah! Okay, alright, 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 alright. We got... We got a lot to go over here. Um... One thing at a time. Oh, that that that's that second one though. <sighs> um. All right. So the image the image is cut off a little bit, but it looks like what we're seeing is everyone's favorite Ravel character. Um. Yeah, I'll give him the benefit of the doubt. It is cut off, but it says Spider Man Adventure Hero. Again, that's benefit of the doubt. That may that may not be an S. 
That could be any letter. We will we'll never know because we just have this image. But let's see if we can make out what it what it includes here. It includes uh, ten uh, whatever inch Spider Man with fisherman outfit. Right? Because everybody remembers how much uh, Peter Parker enjoys fishing. Right. It was an integral fucking element of, of his character. Right? That he was a master angler. You know, it was kind of unfair to the fish. It was kind of unsportsmanlike because he would use his spidey sense to know, like, when there were fish nearby and, and when he was- when they were gonna bite and everything. This is an unfair ad advantage. But there's also a... Archer... Archer outfit... And accessories, because, you know, again... First of all, I... I, I what the fuck is an Archer outfit? <laughs> what are they talking about? What is an out Archer outfit? Well, now you know. Well, okay, so, oh, there, there's, there's a lot to unpack here. This is a, this, this, these, these fucking rivers run deep. Cause you got, well, luckily for Spider-Man, cause it means there's gonna be plenty of fish in the rivers. We have the bow. Maybe somebody got confused and they, and they mixed up Spider-Man with like the, uh, the Green Arrow. Or whatever the fuck. What's the what's the Avenger that nobody gives a shit about? Hawkeye. Hawkeye. Yeah, Haw Haw Hawkeye. See, I didn't even. I said Green Arrow. Isn't that DC? Yes. Haw Hawkeye. Did my proving my point? They got Spider Man mixed up with Hawkeye, which is amazing because you took like everybody, one of everybody's like top three favorite fucking superheroes, and then you mix it up with everybody's fucking like bottom one of everyone's bottom three favorite superheroes, right? Fucking incredible. And then correct me if I'm wrong, but is this is this not like a Oh my god. I okay, no no. I initially I, I saw like a, a bootleg Captain America shield. I thought it was like a shitty Captain America shield, but it's not. It's a target practice for, for Spider Man to, you know, work on his archery that he's so fucking renowned for. Yeah. That they included a uh you know an, a target practice. So he could work on his fucking archery. That's what that is. It is not that would that would be juicy though. If it was a Captain America shield. But it isn't. But it isn't. Let's, you know, let's take it easy. There to check out this image. Like, this is what you're going to be able to do if you buy this fucking masterpiece of, of molded plastic. And bring it home with you. Uh, you know, for, for, for you to enjoy. You're going to be able to uh, play with Spider-Man in, in, his, in, his, in his fisherman outfit. With his, uh, with his fisherman. There he is on, on the lake there going, you know, going, 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 going fly fishing. There he is. Wow, he's... Maybe he's fishing for the bad guys. What do you think? <laughs> maybe that... Maybe that's the implication. Surely it's not literal fishing. Oh, but it is. Because there's a fucking fishing rod right here. And I want you to... I want you to notice what I... I guess is the lure on the end of the, of the, of the fishing rod. Hey, guys, is that a four-legged spider? What is that? Oh, wow, this is a rough fucking deal. But uh, you know, I don't I don't know what a fisherman is supposed to dress like. I guess um well you know what? No no. When you watch Deadliest Catch, right? You've, you've seen it before, right? Have, have you ever seen De Deadliest Catch, Wolf? Yeah, yeah, I used to watch it a lot. So you you notice that the, the, well, they're crabbers, which I guess yeah, they're, they're fishermen, but they're crabbers, they're crabbermen, whatever the fuck. It's this, they, they, they're you know they're they they fish, they go fishing, they they hold things out of the ocean. They wear uh, meat aprons, don't they? Yeah, they do. And it looks like Spider Man is wearing um, yeah, a meat apron, which is in it's in it's in uh, what do you call it? The the theme is there. Like, they didn't go changing his fucking outfit into something wacky. Like, they gave him the fisherman overalls. Like, the plastic or rubber, right? Fisherman overalls. But they kept the theme. They didn't fuck with it. It's got the spider there. It's, uh, you know, it's red and, 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 and blue with the spider web pattern on it. 
he clearly sewed that himself. I think, um, could have been worse. Could have been a lot worse. Just kidding, it's fucking terrible. We also have a, uh, like, a sun hat. What is that hat? Isn't that like a farmer hat? When I look at fucking Fisherman Spider-Man, I don't see a, 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 a fucking fisherman. I see a farmer. I'm seeing a farmer. This looks like a farmer to me. Oh, his mouth, though. Oh, is it a sex mouth again? No, oh, look at that mouth. What is what is going on with it? Oh, oh no. He's got like he's got like an anime mouth. <laughs> the eyes too. That's not cool, man. I don't I don't I don't like that. Yeah, I don't. If you were Spider-Man, right? And you want to catch fish. Use the webs. Twip, twip, twip. You see a fish? Twip it. Twip it with your wrist. You know, your, 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 the web slinging thing? Maybe the webs lose uh, the torque in the water. Maybe if you try to fucking shoot a web into the water, it loses its momentum because it hits the water and then it's got to, you know, it's web. Maybe that doesn't work. Oh, you wouldn't want that on your food, though. Like, if you're trying to get the web off of the fish. Yeah, but doesn't he have the ability to to, 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 to take it off anytime he wants? He has, like, a fucking, like, a solvent that removes it, right? So if he fucking captures a bad guy and then he's gonna bring him to prison... Like, he doesn't just drop him off at the fucking prison, like, wrapped in the, in the you know, the, the web shit that, you know, you have to... That you can't break, because it's unbreakable, isn't that? Isn't that part of the fucking... The, the, his power, that the web is unbreakable? And only he has the, I want to say antidote, but like the solvent that dissolves it and frees you from it. Uh, oh God, I don't know. I don't know a lot about Spider-Man. I might have just pulled this out of my fucking asshole. I think this came from my asshole. Yeah, this came from my asshole. Yeah, it did. The fish are slimy and the web might not stick. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> Uh, it does dissolve after a, f a few hours, I'm being told, uh, Toast Points. Thank you for coming to the stream tonight, Toast Points. Gabraham Lincoln says that the good news is he has a solvent. The bad new news is it's toxic. Oops. It's an enzyme. Yeah, it's an enzyme, cool fang. The bad enzymes! That's the word. That's the smart word. Enzymes. He's got the enzymes. Yeah, po uh, Polis KPS, he said, look at the dick grabbing hands, which I was going to point that out, but then it occurred to me that mo mo well, most, uh, to be fair, a, a lot of action figures have, have dick grabbing hands, right? Yeah. Because, I mean, you know, they'll come when they come with accessories. That's how you put them in the hands. So, I mean, you know, if you want to say this is a, you know, a fucking uh, web slinging circle jerk, you have to say that about about the majority of action figures. Although the the, uh, the pants uh, kind of give a hint that maybe there could be a little bit of jerking. Like there's like maybe there's a little bit of like a, like a um like a gay thing happening here. Maybe a little bit. I mean, you know, just two you, you, two you... Spider Men going outdoors. <laughs> two Spider Bros being bros, you know, trip trip. You know, laying down some sticky white stuff together. Nothing gay about it. But it it is funny that you 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 went there because th the instant my mind saw this image, and I know it did, I I looked at it and my my brain you know did its did its work it's, it, which it does very slowly as you know. But I saw like my my immediate thought was Village People Spider Man. <laughs> like I saw you know the one the one on the right you know is I don't know if there's a farmer like Village People per person I I don't I don't know if that's a you know. But it just, that hat and the overalls, I feel like, yeah, village people, I don't know. And the one on the left, you got, you know, which I guess is the, uh, what the fuck is it supposed to be? The archer outfit. Because, you know, there's a spe specific outfit that you wear. When you go to the archery range or whatever. There's not, right? I don't know anything about archery. But in any case. I think so, no. Well, sorry, I cut you off, what? What were you going to say? No, I was just... No, I don't think so. There's not. Unless the thing that Hawkeye wears is the, the archery outfit. Isn't it just like a spandex latex? I mean, that 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 could be any of them. They will wear that. Yeah. You know what, I know... Just, I think I, they got something going on there. 
I, I just rapidly came to the conclusion that, like, I don't give a shit. Yeah. <laughs> if I was going to, if I was going to go to the archery range, I would do it in, in like full link regalia. Like I would go in like a link cosplay, with the tights and the tunic and, and everything and the hat. Because that's you know I think a lot of like me me wanting to 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 do any interest I had in archery probably started when I played Ocarina of Time on Nintendo 64. So what I would like to do is, you know, put on the, um, like, the twink suit, right? Go down to the archery range and just make, like, you know, like, the, like, the, the twink crunch, like, the... Like, in the Link outfit, while, like, people are just... Stared at me, wondering, like, what asylum I escaped from. <laughs> you see in the bulge, though, right? On the, uh, the what's-his-name? Yeah. You see that boner? Oh, yeah. Like, spidey Ted stenses are tingling. <laughs> and by that, I mean my dick. Because look at the shirt, right? Like, he's got the open shirt. You can see the chest, the rippling chest. That's just, that's like the construction worker. For the village people, construction worker. Though, so, he's also, he's also wearing like the Spider-Man suit un underneath the, uh, so, so if he is gonna go uh, to, to fucking to the archery range, or if, if he is gonna go to the, 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 the fucking, to go fishing, wouldn't he take the Spider-Man suit off? Does he not <laughs> want the fucking fish to know his secret identity? Well, oh, can't have the striped bass find it out that I'm Peter Parker. What the fuck is going on? You never know who's gonna come crawling out of the river, though. That's that's some Marvel supervillain. Isn't there like a crocodile man who might who may very well be like living in the river? That's like one of the the, the Spider-Man antagonists. It's like a crocodile guy. Yeah, I think he's like a sewer guy, though. I'm not sure. Mm -hmm. Fish facade. What's up? Thanks for coming tonight. Um. Fucking! You know, I need to fucking give my myself like a brain enema after this. <laughs> Outdoor heroes, and one wonders why they couldn't give you one action figure with two outfits. You get two action figures with with two outfits. I guess it wouldn't be a circle jerk if you only had one one Spider Man, right? One is the loneliest number. Two's company. Three's, three's a bukkake bath. Oh, no. Now, I did already see the next one, so it was already spoiled for me, but... Mm. Oh my goodness. Oh, you know what I just realized? I think it's my fault that the resolution sucked on a lot of these images. Yeah, you know why? Because I didn't take the original from Discord. I took, like, the thumbnail image, like, the compressed image. That's my fault. Fuck. <laughs> Fuck. Fuck. Oh, we could have got a lot of enjoyment out of those Sailor Moon bootlegs. Whatever, it's done. Sorry, guys. Um. We saw what was going- <laughs> we, we saw what was going on. It's a very easy mistake to make testicle warts, to be fair. Uh. It's not the first time it's happened to me. This is from, um... A very infamous toy uh, toy company. That's called Obvious Plant. Now I have I have seen these honestly. I have seen things from Obvious Plant before, and as awesome as this is, I didn't realize it was from Obvious Plant. The truth about Obvious Plant is, they deliberately manufacture joke items. Mm -hmm. They do. Did you know that? Yes. You did, but you don't care because this is that good. Yeah. Okay. So here we have, and this will be the last one of the night. Do you, you got any more you're sitting on? I have one, but it's not an image. It's more of a quiz for you. Ooh! And that's part of why I gave you this one last. Okay, sounds delightful. All right. Um, I may, like, I'm going to, after the stream, I think I'm going to, yeah, I'm going to go offline. I might, might, might come back a little bit later with, um, and stream, like, a game a little bit later tonight. 
I don't know yet. I want to see how I feel. I also want to see um, if a certain plan ends up going through or not. But I'll tweet that. That's another thing. Don't worry about that just yet. But for now, worry about this. Fuck. I dropped it onto the chat. Now I have to reopen the chat. <laughs> you got that's what a what a fucking cock tease. Wow, that's lame. Okay. Good shit, asshole. <laughs> Oh, well, I opened up the channel, and you, you, do, you, do you know how many people are here? Do you have the channel open? I uh, see, like, 400-something. How did 400 people fucking come and, and, and stay for this? People love trash. They do, don't they? Alright, hold on. I have to fucking reset up everything because I'm a fucking penis. How, how are there 400 people here for this trash? Guys, thank you, by the way. Let me say this before, um, you know, it gets too late. Trying a new thing here. It's an experiment. I'm experimenting. Thank you for coming along for the ride and tolerating my bullshit. I hope you guys are having a good time tonight because I, I am. And I want to, you know, I want to do, yeah, I want to do stuff that, that makes me happy. I want to give you content that you enjoy, but I also want to do things that I enjoy. So, if you guys are having a fucking blast with this, then that, that to me means that I got a fucking slam dunk, dunk here. Because I figure I'm going to do these, eh, like, once a month. I'm not going to fucking, you know, I'm not going to go crazy with these. Me, you know, like, I think once a month is probably good for this thing. I think the plan is to maybe have, like, guests come on and then bring their own bootlegs. So, we'll have, you know, we'll have other people uh, join me in the, in, in the future. Yeah. Um, Maybe some, like... Maybe some celebrity guests. You know? Maybe I'll get like... Andrew Garfield to come on with some bootlegs. Maybe I'll get Snoop Dogg to come on. Maybe I'll get the masterminds behind Obvious Plant to come on the, uh, that, that bootleg show. Fish Facade. Go back to the fabric. Thank you. He says, thank you for streaming and all that. Thank you for watching and also the support. Obama? You better fucking believe I'm going to get Obama. <laughs> he doesn't have a lot going on these days, right? He could probably swing by. <laughs> Don't worry about that. Worry about this. The Revengers, Endless Tussle, The Incredible Fella. Yeah, I laughed really hard at this before because I would I would have laughed less if I had known that it wasn't it wasn't like you know honest. But uh, you got an absolutely gross looking yeah Hulk figure. He's uh he's, he is he is ready for jerking. He showed up primed for crystal charging. I like how he's not wearing shorts though. He's wearing pants. Interestingly enough, you gotta appreciate the attention to detail, even if it's not, you know, it, it, it's a manufactured bootleg. He's got ripped shorts, like you could see like a rip going on there, but then they just continued to paint the legs all the way down to like the ankles, are you seeing that? Yeah, that's, that's great. You also got this delightful image. Reminds me of the son I am disappoint meme, right? And then, uh, yeah, the incredible fella. I always love the word, um, any kind of bastardization or variation on the word, like, Avenger. I think one of the, yeah, probably one of my all-time favorite bootlegs. Hey, let me see if I can find this real quick. Because this one left a big, big, big impression on me. Um, fuck, I'm not seeing it. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not seeing it. Uh, this is going to be a tough one to find. I probably have to, probably would have to sift through for a while looking for it. But, um, my friend showed me a, um, it was a collection of toys. Like, you know, like one of those, like you get like six toys when you buy the box type of thing. But they, they spelled it, um, Avegnars. Yeah, the Avegnars. 
So they fucked up the uh, the placement of the the G. Yeah. And I believe I believe there was an A instead of an E. So there is absolutely no uh, proofreading done there. I think a lot of the time you want to say that English isn't their first language, but then, you know... Sometimes you feel like there really is no excuse for the incompetence. Endless tussle. Of Vegnars. Vegnars, you all have been a bad kitty cat. This is my little second name. Now, you know what, you know what that is? Uh, ribonucleic ass hat. This is this is my shawarma. Iron Man doesn't want doesn't want to give the shawarma to um to Andrew Garfield, who doesn't play Spider Man anymore. But don't worry about it; it works. Um, you said you got a, th a thing. You got one more thing before we wrap it up here. What do you, what do you got? Yeah. So this is something I can't confirm. There's not a lot of sources on this, so this is pretty weird. Okay. Um, it's a rumor about what China has given as nicknames for the main Avengers cast. Now, where did this come from? Like who? Like who? Who gave them the nicknames? This appears to be just like Chinese uh, movie goers mm. in general. Okay. Give them the nickname. Okay. So. What I'm going to do is I'm going to give you a character, and I want you to try and guess what that character is called. I love this. Okay, yeah. All right, so we're going to start with Captain America. What do you think he's called? Um, I think he's called Donald Trump. <laughs> do they call him uh, Donald Trump? No. Do I? How many guesses do I get? You get three. All right, they call him... Um, they call him baseball man baseball no. man no it's a good effort but no uh freedom guy they call him freedom guy no that would be a good choice but but no they call him Captain Big Tit, or sometimes Ex just Big Tits. Excuse me? Did you say Captain Big Tits? Posted in the chat. Yes, Captain Big Tits. So that's or the translation from, 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 from Chinese, or one of the Chinese languages. <laughs> Before I get in trouble for that again, I don't know. I know there's multiple languages, but fucking Captain Big Tits. All right, so <laughs> now that's not confirmed to be true, right? You said... It's not confirmed, but there's not a lot of... There's no sources saying that it's fake. So, here's... Okay, a couple questions. I, I'm going to assume they're talking about... um, What's his name? Chris Evans, like, his pec, his pectorals. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Um, Which are, you know, they're they're sizable, and they're pretty... They're pretty... Yeah, they're pretty spherical. Like, they're very... They've got a round shape. So, I mean, for... You know, for somebody to, like, be like, hey, Captain, Captain Big Tits... Uh, I could see it. I could see it. However... When you say this, this is what I need to know. I'm not going to try to pronounce that. Yes, I am. I'm a dick. Danai uh, Dewizhang. Do you have, like, in there the slur, like, for breasts? Like, is that, like, you know, the the, wor the word for, for, for tits that, like, you're not supposed to say in front of your mom? Type of a thing? Like, is is that, yes. is that, that, that's what that is? Yeah. Oh, well. It's, it's also, it's a little bit confusing with Chinese where, like, the literal translation for these things is mm -hmm. never what you would want to use. This is the literal translation. Uh, so, like, the literal translations for, like, state are also really hilarious, too. That's for another time. For state? Yeah, for, like, the U.S. states. Like, the literal translations are amazing. And they they really use those? Yeah. Can you tell me, like, one? Like, can you tell me, like, a good, a good one? Try and find them. Uh, in the meantime, I want you to try and guess what Spider-Man's called. Spider-Man. Uh, Jumpy Boy. J Jumpy Boy? Nope. Chat, 
has a lot of uh, a lot of if you see the right answer in chat don't you know i'm not gonna look at the chat because they're influencing my 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 thinking about it so mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. um come slinger jizz no jizz 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 slinger Um, I gotta make this. I gotta make this count. Skinny shit boy. He's just little bug. Little bug. Yep. There was a lot of things like that in the in the chat. What if they're just all B Captain Big Tits, illegitimate gamer? What if the correct answer to every single one of these is Captain Big Tits? <laughs> <laughs> right. What do you What do you think uh, the Hulk is? Also, a literal translation. Um, I'm gonna give the literal one for Maine. Which is just distant reason. What? Yeah, that's what the state of Maine is literally in in Chinese. Now, why? Because they it's so it, it if you if you take the word like just this this phonetic sound Maine, and then you say it, you know, in China. Are they gonna Are they gonna think they're gonna hear distant reason? Basically, yeah, because the the way that they make the names, they make them based on sound. So, oh, so it's so gotta be just a bunch of that sounds like me. Completely random shit. Yeah. Oh, that's awesome. I gotta look into that. That sounds delightful. It actually kind of works because I actually I can't think of a, of a single reason to to ever go to Maine. <laughs> With a distant reason being like maybe fresh lobster, but I could get that in Massachusetts pretty easily. So I don't have to go the extra the extra two states away. Wow, that's I love that. Holy shit, that's kind of great. I need to see the rest of these, but let's let's let yeah let's save that. Um, so you want me to know what they call the Hulk? Yeah. Um. Strong chode. Strong chode. Nope. Mm. Muscle vein. They call him muscle vein. No. Mm. They call him th thick neck man. They call him Green Fatty. <laughs> He's got 0% body fat. He's literally all muscle. That's the point of the character. He's, he's fucking it's too much muscle. There's no fat on the Hulk. Why do they call him Green Fatty? <laughs> uh, <laughs> they also call uh, North Korean leader Kim Jong uh, Kim Fatty the third. Oh, that's excellent. <laughs> yeah. Kim Fatty. Green Fatty. Oh, it's like, hey, bro, you want to go smoke a Green Fatty? It's rolled up a fat blunt. Oh, smoke a Green Fatty, dude. Bro, smoke a Green Fatty. All right. Who else you got for me? All right, Thor. Um... Mm, <laughs> blonde Dirtbag. No. Um, muscle, uh, muscle twink, muscle twink. No. Um, mm, hammer man. Close, but no. It's brother hammer. Brother hammer. 
Hey, it's me, Marlo, and my brother, Brother Hammer. We're gonna hammer up your sink. Here we go. We're gonna eat some scongeli. Who the fuck is left, even? Like, how many Avengers are even left? We got we got Iron Man, Black Widow, Hawkeye, and then the Avengers themselves. All right. Um... Hawkeye. So they got a name. They got a name for Hawkeye. Or did they? Did they you care enough about him to give him a name? They gave him a name. Useless bitch. No. Um. Arrow Man. Nope. Um. Uh... Yeah, I'm trying to think of, like, defining characteristics of the character, but there aren't any. He uses a bow. If he had, like, a subplot in any of the Avengers movies, I don't remember it. Oh, there's a, something where he, he, he was fucking uh, Scarlett Johansson or some fucking ham-fisted fucking romance bullshit, right? Am I right? No. That never happened? No, that didn't Did happen. I make that up? Yes. It happened. No, it happened. It did. It did. It did happen. I didn't pull that from my ass. It could, something like that happened. No, really? <laughs> no, that was that was the Hulk. The Hulk was was fucking Scarlett Johansson. Yeah. Bullshit. So there really was nothing going on with the fucking Arrow dude. Um. Bird, I, I, uh, uh, bird, bird man, bird vision, uh, bird vision. You're so close. Bird what? <laughs> fat birdie. <laughs> Why is everybody fat? <laughs> no, his nickname is Obese Eagle. <laughs> Obese Eagle. Guy's in great shape. <laughs> Guy's in great fucking shape. What are they talking about? fuck's going on is this someone in, in in um yeah chat keeps making the joke that they just look at americans like we're all fat is that really what's going on here uh that could be i i think there's another reason why fat is used a lot to describe things but I'm not remembering it's been a long time since i took a class with mandarin i'm starting to get really like offended by this now at this point i mean well, Testicle Warts is saying, I think China doesn't know what muscle is. That might be why everybody is fat. But didn't, like, like... There's, like... like I'm thinking of, like... Bruce Lee. Right? Jackie Chan. They have muscle. They they know what muscle is. Like, I, I don't... I don't... I don't... I don't want to hear that. that. That's not the answer to this. Maybe they don't have, like, a culture of, like, bodybuilding in China, but I did... You're telling me in a country with how many fuck a billion people live in China? A lot. <laughs> no, no, Nobody works out? Nobody's into bodybuilding as, like, a hobby? Of course, there has to be. What is this... This is... What is this about? There's something... There's something else going, going, going on here. There's something <laughs> else going on. Uh, Alright, who else we got? Uh, we got Iron Man, Black Widow, and Avengers. Iron Man. Um. Metal Man. No. Um. Fat Robot. <laughs> no. Fat Robot. No. Um. Cokehead. Sorry. Iron can. Iron can. All right, that's a clever one. I'll give. All right, that's clever. But he's also called Nee Nee because uh, Tony Stark's first name uh, and Robert Downey Jr.'s last name remind them of something feminine. So they think that he is cold on the outside and warm on the inside, like girls. 
Oh, okay. That's one of those <laughs> things. That's just one of those things where like you, you look at somebody and you nod. You're like, you got it. What the fuck? Well, I mean, he probably is warm on the inside because he's got. Doesn't he have like a like a fucking nuclear core for a heart? Yeah, it's probably it's probably toasty in there. All right, so you got you got Black Widow and you got Avengers. Black Widow's name is going to be Boob Lady. Nope. Um. Titty Spider. Um, but woman, no, sister widow, sister widow. It's the scourge. They just call her the scourge. Hey, scourge, fat titty, Katon. How did fat titty not occur to me? Yeah, <laughs> fat titty. And the Avenger, the yeah, the Avengers has to just be like they call it like the the fucking obese squad. The Avengers one is, is great, so I don't think you're gonna be able to guess it, but give it a give it your best shot. Um. Hmm. The fat friends. No. Collection of revenge-oriented miscreants. No. Um, I, I get the tubby team. <laughs> Neutrino, yeah. The tubby team. Oh. Weight Watchers. They call no. them the Weight Watchers. So I've got the official one and the unofficial one. Okay. The official one is Avengers Federation. Okay. But the shorthand for that has a uh, feminine form. Okay. So, they're known as the Women's Federation. The Women's Federation. There's one female Avenger? <laughs> right? There's probably there's probably maybe two or three now. I, I don't know how many there are now. Did they there, add one of more of, of, of Vegnars? Did they add more Vegnars to the team? I mean, for Infinity War, I think they had to add a bunch more. The Vegnars... Getting their vengeance upon those who would do injustice to other people who would not do injustice. The Avegnars. What kind of fuck life is this? <laughs> Alright, well. I guess we're done. Yeah, what that's, time is it? That's it for now. We did that for two hours? Yeah, just about. My god. And this was barely scraping the surface. There was good, so much. It was a good so length. It was a good length. I mean, you know, I, I feel like yeah, part of me is going to... I'm going to feel like we spent too much time on, like, one bootleg, baby. That's all my fault, by the way. That's I'm I'm, I'm choosing the pace that we, we go through these. Um, Well, chat wants some more. Oh, well, man. Little Scarlet wants more. You don't have any more? I, I could find more. Yeah, like you you just, just wrap it up. You know, surely, you know, there's going to come a day when we would run out of these things. Yeah, right! Oh no, never. Never. My never. my friend who lives in uh, Czech, she she said she's going to keep an eye out for any bootlegs because apparently they have a lot. Oh, they, that's awesome. They spent a long time under communist rule, so they made their own knockoffs to, like, everything. Oh, that's some good shit. I feel like if you had a reason to create the knockoffs, like, your country had no relationship with, like, you know, the, the, the country of the original thing, and you couldn't, you know, ask their permission or, or whatever. It's still wrong, but it's not as fun as, like, the bootlegs where somebody just makes them because fuck you. <laughs> you know? Like... Yeah. Alright. So, apparently there's art. Um, let me first say, guys, thank you for coming to hang out for this new thing that I'm trying here tonight. Um, I had a fucking blast. I hope you guys did too. Um, if anybody's new, there's links to my social media and, uh, uh, YouTube channels in the chat. Thank you, Sick Today. Um, there was some subs, resubs. Guys, thank you for, for, um, for all that stuff. Really appreciate it. Um, being told that there's art, which I, 
I, I didn't expect, but I don't know why I, I, I didn't expect it. Uh, but we do have art, and it's lovely. Uh, oh, oh, my... Oh, uh, what's this? Um, if you made art, by the way, you can tweet it at me with the hashtag JabroniMyGart. Lord Dickfist just uh, resubbed. Welcome back to the family, Dickfist. By the way, I noticed that Dickfist. Um, did you just like make a Twitter account to to follow like me and, and Vinny and 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 Rev and, like I don't know something else? Cause I saw your name, I was like, oh, I just feel like. I've been seeing Lord Dickfist around for a while. Like, how is it that they just they just followed me on Twitter? And I saw the account. You know, you could see like a brand spanking new account. Dickfist just I, I I wanted to say thank you for making a Twitter account just, just to follow like me and two other people. I appreciate it. <laughs> Something from what looks like uh Azathoth or Mothfather. I've been super busy this week with a huge project. It's finally done with the grade of 94. So here's a celebratory jabroni to celebrate. Let us celebrate with the celebratory jabroni. I have no more mugs. There are more mugs that I could take advantage of, but they're not mine. They're my mom's mugs. And I feel like if I break those two, that makes me just a fucking asshole. And a bad son. And I'm not trying to be that. However, I'm thinking about investing in my own mugs so I could drink coffee. And then inevitably break the mugs when I get pissed off. Mugs turn out to be they're they're kind of they're kind of expensive. Ceramic mugs. But um, you know what? You guys have been generous to me with the with the sobs and everything and the bipe and the, the Patreon. So yeah, maybe I'll just uh, maybe I'll just throw that money down the fucking toilet by buying a bunch of mugs and then fucking just smashing them for no reason. That sounds like a good use of that money. I was talking about how I want to fucking start saving up in like a retirement account. Nope, fuck that. Let's buy a bunch of mugs and then smash them live on stream. <laughs> I am a millennial after all. That sounds like something a millennial would do, doesn't it, Wolf? Oh, absolutely. I mean, you're not ruining the mug industry. Yeah. I saw this awesome tweet. Um, the person was like, in quotations, Millennial, millennials do dumb uh, things with, the, with their money. M millennials do frivolous things with their money. Says the generation who keeps a set of quote-unquote nice plates and also a set of regular plates. As if anybody gives a shit. I don't know about you, but that 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 goes on here. Like, there's there's the fucker the the nice plates. Yeah. I guess this is yeah. a, this may be like a very middle class thing. I'm gonna I don't I don't know. But you got your nice plates, your quote unquote nice plates that you you, you whip out for Thanksgiving and shit, and then you got your regular plates. So here you go, you animal. It's not a holiday, all right. Here you go, use the regular plates like a fucking animal. I swear to God, if you touch those nice plates, you're fucking dead. Or at the very least, you're out of the house. You're out of the house if you eat on the nice plates. It's like, whoa! Yeah, and I mean, the thing the thing that I love about that tweet, it's like, it, it, they dare about it like as if anybody cares. Nobody gives a fuck. The thing that I care about is, is being annoyed. When like, I'm using the, the fancy plate over the regular plate, and somebody's like, what are you using that plate for? What's well, a fucking plate it's made to eat off of, right? No, those are the nice plates. Oh, well, they're indistinguishable to, 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 to the regular plates. If you ask me. Nobody gives a fuck. Nobody cares. Nobody's impressed by that. The guests that you have over. Nobody's like, oh, wow, it's the nice plates versus, versus the regular plates. And if they do care, I don't think I want them over for, for, for the holiday. Fuck that shit. Fuck that judgmental shit. I don't want people sitting around judging my plates. You know what's great about those uh, what? plates? The fine china. The fine china? Yeah. That's the fine china. That's what those nice plates are. I'm gonna so, fucking smash them shits. So I guess uh, Chinese bootlegs for everything except for the, the plates. Those are the finest. Only the finest plates from China. 
Only the finest lead laden bootlegs from China. <laughs> this is from Primal Screen, uh, Primal Screen Guy. And it looks like Dokachu made quite the impression on the stream here tonight. No. A tune Tika Duck Dokachu. This thing is fucking rancid. I and mean, well, he, you know, your take on it is 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 adorable, Primal Screen guy. But I, it's, 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 fuck, that, that it had to exist in in the first place is is unfortunate. Is what I'm trying to say. Um, but it doesn't end there. This is from. 87 octane. I love this creature. I would take a bullet for him. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, this thing turned out to be very popular. Um. Yeah, you 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 made him. Both of you did this. Okay, you you made him a lot cuter than he than he actually is. I mean, like let's be honest here. This thing is fucking disgusting. You're giving it, you're giving it way too much fucking credit. Like, look at that fucking thing. But look at this. Look at his, he's got like the cute pudgy face and he's got like the, meh, meh. you know, he's got the gunt, like the cute gunt and the, um, yeah, you, you brought, you brought all the facial features closer together. You worked, Octane, you worked very hard to make this fucking thing cute and it didn't deserve it. It by, it, it, it by, by no means deserved it. I love the art. Well, you know, the one on the right actually. I was all, I was I was hyper focused on the left one. The one on the right is a little bit less kind. You you may you may you may notice. Come on, yes, let me out of the Pokemon. Come on, yes, I want out. No, Dakachu. Dakachu, you've been a very bad kitty cat. This is my lasagna. None for you, Dakacho. No. Blah, 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 blah. I like it's fucking like the beak sunken into its into, into its fucking face. Ooh, man. Octane, I love it. Thank you. Uh, we got something from Lucario girl to follow up uh, last night's Garfield conversation yes sleep and dream of bootlegs my child sleep believing you can keep me from my lasag absolutely horrifying oh look at his fingers i love it lucario girl thank you so much oh look at the fingers look at the fuck the, the, the fucked up fingernails you see that breaks on them oh that's rough thank you uh for this um <clears throat> I feel like some Garfield bootlegs might be in order for next time. What do you think? Oh, yeah. Oh, there's so many of those. I saw a delightful one not too long ago. Uh, it's going to be a nightmare to find, but... It was a fucking, like, mermaid with Garfield's head, and it had tits. Did you see that one? Uh, I think I saw... I think... It was a ceramic statue where the top half of the body was... was like The, the upper half, the human half of the mermaid was, was Garfield. And it had like it had tits and like a shell, like yeah, a shell bra, and the bottom half, you know, is the the, the the mermaid tail. And then there was like a, it was on like a like, like a stand that had a quote on it, like some kind of fucking like. It might have even been a Bible verse. This thing was fucked up, Wolf. This thing was fucked up. It's right there. <laughs> That's not a Bible verse. I lied. You're you're good at this. I, I love it's a. Track. I'm... <laughs> What can I say? Well, you, you've been subscribed to the channel for how long? 18 months. It's pretty clear you love garbage. Um, <laughs> it's the description for Pisces. That's why it's it's a fucking, yeah, it's, it's a mermaid. But I thought that the fucking... I thought Capricorn was a mermaid. Like a goat mermaid. A mer goat. Top half goat, bottom half mermaid. Fish. Goat fish. Pisces, I thought, was just like a fish. 
Couldn't have made a catfish? B whatever. I get it now. It, it's, it makes more sense now. As you know, something that could even be official Garfield merchandise, honestly. It's like, it's that, it's, you know, it's, it's that caliber. Let's be real. This is not fucking above Jim Davis, am I right? Look at this fucking thing. <laughs> this is no, no, by no means uh, above Jim Davis, not at all. He fucking eats this shit up for breakfast. Officially licensed ceramic Garfield versions of the entire horoscope or whatever. Yeah, the Zodiac. I, I could fucking totally see him doing it. Why not? So yeah, it may not even be a bootleg, in fact, but um, there's some more art here. Something from... Ooh, an emote possibility from Alex, the guy. What the fuck did they call him? Hulk Man? What was the name of the... <laughs> the Incredible Fella. Kind of looks like Shrek, doesn't it? A little Shrekky. A little Shrekky. A little bit of... A little bit of layers. Just a few layers, donkey. Donkey brain. We've got something here from... Blah, blah, blah. Sorry, not blah, blah, blah. Frustrated pasta. It says, Fanatics got bored. This is... Uh, Pokemon number 32. His name is Yellow. He just paralyzes your soul altogether. Sell your soul to Satan. Do it, pussy. Do it, you fucking pussy. Do it. There he is, uh, Yellow. Number thir 32, Yellow. You forgot his, um... Yeah, his man bun tail, which I remember. But, uh, I love the art. Thank you, Frustrated Panzer. P pan Panza. Frustrated Panzer. Very different thing. Frustrated Panda, thank you so much for the art. Also got something from the Upside Druzy. I made this mess very quickly. First mic art. It could be better. It's awesome. I think it is better. I think it's 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 more better than you think it's better. I don't know what that meant, but there's a compliment in there. Uh, I love it, Druzy. Hope to see more art from you in the future. It's fucking outstanding. I do you. you very obviously got talent. Please continue to pursue this. I will fucking support you as much as I can because I love you and I want to nurture your talent. And that goes for everybody here, including you, Wolf. Thank you for doing this with me. This was a lot of fun. Hey, this was great. Um, I think I also got Sick Today uh, signed on for, for one of these streams. Um, we'll, we'll mix it up. Um, I do, you know, I, I do want to limit it to, to, to people that I know pretty, pretty closely. Um, and me and, me and Volf have become, um, we've developed a, a pretty, uh, pretty considerable bromance here, I, I want, I, I, I want to say. Am I overstepping my boundaries with that, the bromance? Do we have a bro? could I, could I call it a bromance? Yeah, why not? We're both <laughs> old cranky people. This is a bromance. Just bros being bros, slinging, slinging webs, sw slinging white substance that's just, that's definitely, definitely just webs. <laughs> definitely just webs while dressed as the village people. That's a good note to go out on. Guys, thank you so much for coming to check out the, uh, that bootleg show. It's that bootleg show. What show is that? Oh, it's that bootleg show. You know, the bootleg one. The one that is a bootleg, but is also about bootlegs. I thought it was clever. It's not as clever as I think it is, is it? <laughs> it's perfect for, for this kind of trash. You know, fucking somebody on Twitter accused me of fucking plagiarizing the, 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 the prostitutes. <laughs> you serious? Like I ripped it off from an early... It's like, nah, motherfucker. The prostitutes is probably the only original idea I've ever had in my life. You do not fucking get to try to take that away from me. Fuck no. Fuck no. I will fucking go down fucking in a fucking hail of bullets to defend the fucking prostitutes as my original idea. I mean that. I will, I will fucking die from that. I will <laughs> die for the prostitutes. Yes. Yes. The only original idea I ever had in my life. It's mine. No. <laughs> I think not, good sir. 
Don't you even raise that specter of a fucking possibility. No. Don't, don't you eat possibility. Possibility. There is a pasta joint in in. Uh, I think it's in Brooklyn, or it was in Brooklyn. Yeah, it was called Past Pastabilities. It was a pun. Yeah, the pun pun restaurant. Um, it was it was satisfaction when he was joking around. But all right, let's seriously go, guys. Lots of love. I'm gonna try to do something over the weekend. I don't think I'm gonna get to though. I may be do something in like an hour from now. Um, I don't know what yet. It may not happen. Let me see how it works out. Stay tuned. Follow me on Twitter to get the. If I go live, I'll tweet it. Blah 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 blah. I'll see you real soon, guys. <laughs>